Hello and welcome back to another installment of Thursday Throwdown, the show where we pit two Golden Age sets against each other. You vote for the figures on our teams. I'm your sexy ranch and co-host Calderness, and of course we got Simeon Bruce. This week I am building out of DC 75th anniversary, and Simeon is building out of Thwip Thwip, the web of Spider-Man. Simeon, why don't you go into your team? Tell us all. We're playing 600 points, guys. 600 points, no tent poles. So this is a we're, this is a this is a real slugging it out team. We got some higher point figures, and there was, but like no one over a, like two hundred, no one over a buck sixty, yeah. you know. So there was a, you guys passed up on Iron Man War Machine three hundred point. <laughs> you passed up on Cosmic Spider Man. Uh, so there was a lot of like options for uh, big old boys, but uh, rocking the Web of Spider Man team. First up, we've got Puma. So. Mm. He's got the Animal, the Modox 11, the Mystical, and the Outlaws keywords. Uh, just a basic charge, close combat guy. Uh, he gets some like flurry blades, starts off with charge blades. Rocket a double rollout, super senses, shape change, top dial, which I really like for 56 points. Uh, solid defense values his whole dial as well. Combat reflexes at the end, keeps him safe at close. Um, mm. His... His attack value isn't, like, super solid throughout, but uh, other than that, like, he's at least going to be a great tie-up piece for me. Uh, next up is number 104, Dakin, the limited Dakin. edition. Dakin. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. However you say it, it's he's, fine. He's wearing the, it's even, like, the Dark Rain version where he's wearing Wolverine's outfit. He's got a trait, which is smell through disguises. Or just disguise. Uh, opposing characters within six squares can't use shape change. So he's even better than that new Wolverine mm. that's in with, within three. Uh, he also has backstab. Modify Dakin's damage value plus one for each action token on the target of his attack. So Ooh. he can do, Ooh. you know, four exploit. No move and attack. He does have some mind control mid-dial with blades. Some randomly dispersed regen. So it's possible for me to, like, I don't know, land on click four heal up to click two, heal up to click one, if I'm so inclined. Uh, next up, we've, of course, got the 047 Nightcrawler. So he's got a trait, extra-dimensional teleportation. He ignores the effects of terrain and characters for movement. It's like permanent phasing, except, uh, you know, traded. Um his speed power is he can use hypersonic speed, stealth, and the carry ability. When Nightcrawler uses hypersonic speed, a target hit by a close combat attack may be placed adjacent to Nightcrawler after the power action resolves. So I can just yank people, like, I don't know, seven squares back or however far I go with my hypersonic. Uh, Nightcrawler can use super senses. When he uses super senses to ev evade an attack, you may immediately move him up to half his speed value. So, if I do use Super Senses and succeed, which he's also got Shape Change top dial, so double roll out there, I could just go like seven squares away with him. Dude, I, I hate these cool. double rollouts right now. You yeah. have two double rollouts on your team? This team already feels kind of stacked for me. Uh, moving on to more Super Senses. Not a lot of reducers, though. Um, Bombastic Bagman is, of course, you know, the Fantastic Four coming out. Really wanted to get this guy a good playthrough. Uh, I'm probably going to try and pick one up, to be honest, because he's got a trait, a single trait. He's five clicks long for 90 points. It doesn't really seem worth it on the outset, but his single trait is whenever Bombastic Bagman takes damage from an attack, deal the attacker penetrating damage equal to the damage taken by Bombastic Bagman. So they take exactly the same amount that he gets. Uh, Bombastic Bagman can't be healed except my Fantastic Four team ability. Uh, I do have a few uh, wild cards that can copy Fantastic Four, but he's probably just not going to heal at all. He'll probably be good to like deal like three or four penetrating damage during the game. Um, but yeah, what a cool little ability. Uh, and I think this set is still before Invincible, right? Oh yeah, way before yeah. Invincible. So... Way Nothing before to get around it yet. Uh, next up is this crazy, this crazy tree man, coming in at 152 points, oh. ten clicks long. I feel like this is the best like, point value 
and dial mm-hmm. length that like I've come across so far. Uh, wow. Which is saying a lot because there's been some good stuff. So he starts off with some super strength, invuln, more shape change. He's giant. He goes to the special attack power that is once during your turn as a free action. So I can do this after I move if I want. Uh, you may heal Groot one damage if he occupies hindering or water terrain. And then he's got a special damage power, Floral Colossus Sprout. Non-optional, Groot has the Colossal Damage symbol, a range of four, and can't be moved. And he also has that on his click that is a 13 oh. with six damage mm. and 19 impervious. So... He's really crazy on those clicks. And then he gets I hate region, that. So I hate that. But every one of your characters has a rollout, yeah. by the way. Still. <laughs> it's possible that I get to my regen. And it's weird that he has earthbound on those clicks. I guess that means he can't like use his giant size to move uh, through terrain. But it's weird that he gets it on that because he doesn't have like indom or anything special. Right. Uh, but I could potentially regen up to my special attack power to like constantly free heal all the way back up to click two. Um, I imagine Calder will try and just, you know, avoid those two clicks altogether. I'll Next do my best. Is Wolf's Bane. Uh, <sighs> she starts off with a stealth blades blank defense her whole dial and then Oh shut the... up, blank defense. Uh, Whatever. We've got this special trait form of the wolf wolf spain can use combat reflexes and super senses you have so... three characters with double <laughs> rollouts and everybody has a rollout that's what's crazy is like there's only one figure here that no one voted for and well i don't think anyone really voted for and that's night nurse and i only put her on because i was 30 points short or 29 points short actually um and she, of course, is just support, and then after support, modify the target's defense plus one until the beginning of your next turn. Uh, but yeah, Wolf's Bane here on top click is a Jeez. 19 in stealth with two rollouts. So, yeah. <laughs> did you did you talk about uh, Peter Parker, or was I just not paying attention? Oh, I think I, I think I skipped him after Bombastic Bagman. Okay. Okay. So yeah. Uh, 50 points, probably my biggest waste of points here. Uh, we'll see how it goes. I really want this to work, but it probably won't. Uh, he's got the Alter Ego Spider-Man. Give this character a power action on these last two clicks that he's got here. Uh, give him a power action and replace him with a 007 Spider-Man, which is what I'm using, or a 022 Spider-Man on its orange starting line. Existing character, Existing actions from this character, as well as action tokens and pushing damage for this action are applied to the replacement. If replaced, no victory points are awarded for this character and the replacement is considered to be orange point value for all game effects. So, 50 points. Okay. Uh, if he switches, he goes to... D- don't even have him pulled up. Sad. Yeah. Sad. He goes to this Leap Climb Super Strength. Okay. Spider with a super senses but on why does he have six. a four through six super senses <laughs> and then, Jeez. Uh, his special damage is web shooters once at the beginning of your turn if spider-man has no action tokens as a free action he may place a web special terrain marker in a square occupied by a target opposing character within six squares and line of fire okay and those are just like you have to break away from them kind of things sure Ugh. i That's a lot of stuff there's not a lot of reducers on your team, but no. there is a ton of rollouts, a ton. Um, so that's cool. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. We have the Beast Boys, main forcing just uh, probably Beast Boy himself, uh, probably actually the Bear. He has Morph. This is the same with all of them. Give Beast Boy a move action that deals no pushing damage after the action resolves. Uh, replace him with any character with this trait on the same click number. Existing action tokens and action tokens for the action are applied to the replacement. So that's cool. This guy is just combat reflexes, safe change. It's cool they just have outsiders, though, which is pretty neat. Yeah, pretty the cool. next beast boy is the bear, the only one with charge. Charge blades, 10 for 3. Pretty solid. Going to some more tie-up. Got toughness. It's neat. Uh, next up, we have the cheetah, beast boy animal. Hypersonic speed, fastest Fastest freaking land mammal, baby. 
um, with a 10, 9, you got some Super Senses, some more Blades, some Flurry Late Dial, pretty all right, the Cheetah. My personal favorite is the T-Rex, which I absolutely love. No move and attack top dial, but an 11 for 4, Giant Reach 2. He has tiny little arms, can't use a carry ability, and then he has a damage power, which is Chomp. Give Beast Boy a close combat action. He can target up to three characters with a single close combat attack and divide the damage between each hit target. When he targets at least two characters this way, he may re-roll his attack roll once, which is dope. So I, I love the T-Rex. Once we get into the thick of it, you know your boy is switching to the T-Rex. Um, and then next up we have Ragdoll, who, this is my only character with double rollouts, and I was like, oh cool, this character's got double rollouts, whatever. <laughs> now, I'm, uh, now I'm less enthused about her 16 defense, hey, but she's, she's crazy good. Less Puma, who has, also has double rollouts. Yeah, and she's got great tie-up. So she's plasticity or hold dial, double rollouts. Um, she has something that works with the parademon. We don't have him. Her trait doesn't matter. But she is like my favorite cowboy from Earth X, Montana, in Won't Let Go. Whenever an opposing character adjacent to Ragdoll is given a move action or power action, after actions resolve, you may place Ragdoll in any square adjacent to that character. So even if you don't move with your power action, if like you do like close combat expert, I can still like move her around if I want to, which is cool. But like she's following you, dude. Ragdoll is there. She's there. She's gonna follow you to the ends of the earth. It's great. Uh, next up, 039, Guy Gadna, my favorite Green Lantern, the best Green Lantern, in his Red Lantern form, we have Guy Gardner. His trait, the antagonist, is when he has no action tokens, he can use close combat expert. So if you base guy bam you're getting close combat he is a bit of a conundrum here he's got phasing top dial uh with esd and then he's got exploit weakness so it'll probably be used to just kind of like poke people and they'll be like you know if i gotta base this guy i gotta base this guy and then bam close combat expert i mean he does have eight range but that'd be real he has eight range combat reflexes instead especially with his yeah uh, Trait. With with the whole close yeah. So he's a bit of a weird figure, but he's from that iconic cover when he's facing off against all the lanterns and he's got that chainsaw, which is just beautiful. Another Green Lantern, who is the worst Green Lantern, don't at me, is um Alan what's his Scott. face? Alan Scott. Total loser, Alan Scott. Uh not a bad figure though. Uh only character so far with move and attack. Green Lantern, though. Yeah, he's the magical one who's just such a loser. So he's got running shot with eight range. Uh, impervious which is beautiful but uh, he ignores stealth when a character takes damage from his attack that character cannot use stealth this turn so he's got some of the first ignores hindering going on here and then he can use in cap pen blast and telekinesis with his uh, special attack power which i am a huge fan of some running shot pen blast there next up we have barry allen the flash the flasher barry allen great hypersonic piece 14 speed 11 attack, 3 damage, deeper dial, 8, 8 thing, whatever, 8 clicks, 8 grids of blood. And then his speed power for his last 4 clicks is really sick, so he can use flurry. Before each attack, you may place him adjacent to an opposing character on the map. So if he's somewhere else on the map entirely, yeah, before his first flurry, place you here, oh teleport gosh. over here, boom, slap you over there. I freaking love this. Yeah. Now, he's only a 9 or 8 attack for 2 damage on these clicks. Oh, sure. But still, it's pretty darn cool positioning-wise. Next up, we got Guy Gardner's lady friend, Ice. The Swedish babe herself. Rocking some leap climb, some barrier, some range combat expert. I'm loving, the, loving these 8 ranges, by the way. Loving these 8 ranges. Uh, so, freeze in place is in cap. When she uses it and hits... Uh, no game effect can move or place her target away from the square it's currently occupied until the beginning of your turn. So she might just, maybe, maybe she's a better Spider-Man. I would say she is. That's way better than a web marker. Like, you can't be carried out of that square. You can't be TK'd out of that square. You can't move out of that square. You have to break away from Spider-Man, sure. But Ice says, no, you. You are frozen. Sucks to suck. Next up, Nightmaster. Clocking in. 69 points. Nice. Uh, he has the Mystic Seam ability, so I'm no I'm no bombastic bag man who's going to punch me in the face for whatever damage I deal him as penetrating. But I got a little one pen Mystic's uh, TA going on here. And then he has Mystical Guardian. Nightmaster deals penetrating damage to characters with the Mystical keyword. I don't... Does anyone on your team have Mystical keyword, Simeon? Um, this is somewhat to note. I have a few people with it. Uh, yes, he does, bro. I mean, he doesn't have any reducers but he does have mystical oh yeah yeah that's oh, right there yeah, yeah. so Puma your eyes. does um 
Dakin? No reducers. Couldn't. No reducers, yeah. yeah. He's not no using the Marabusa cool. Blade. Uh, no, not Mary Nightcrawler. Wouldn't, Groot wouldn't. Wolfsbane could. Maybe. Hellions. No. No. X Factor. All right, Force. well, we're getting past Puma's Impervious, baby. Yeah. So, and then he's got a full dial of blades. He's a very vanilla y character. All right, let's go ahead. Let's jump into it, shall we? You can see all of our figures. I got my Nightmaster. He's up on some stairs. Um, I like the railroad rail the Green Lantern is on. I think that's what it is. Maybe it's something else. Hey, man, don't hate on him. He looks great. Um, anything you want to say about your figures? I love the T-Rex. I need to make the T-Rex Chainsaw wild. is pretty sweet on Guy Gardner. Doesn't really, it looks kind of like he's just got like a Star Trek pew-pew phaser thing going Don't on. Don't you dare say that about Guy Gardner. Um, Watch his mouth. Of course, Nightcrawler looks sweet. He's like got, not only on a wall, but like there's like a little teleportation effect behind him. Peter Parker just looks like random schmuck number five or something. Dude, he does. Pretty good. Uh, Night Nurse looks like a old school nurse. Puma, he's got that whatever necklace. Uh, recently in comics, they did like a weird thing with Puma, where they like retroactively made him this like crazy cosmic powerhouse. Even though Wolverine beat him at one point, it was it was a very strange storyline. Um, it was in the Wolverines which was, like, taking place while Wolverine was still dead. Groot is in, like, a weird crouched position, but he's got, like, that old-school uh, Galactic Guardians, Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, whatever they're called. Um, so, yeah, I like all the sculpts, really. Nice. And then Alan Scott, what is he standing on? A piano? Oh, no, no, no. He's, like, I think he's on, like, it's supposed to be, like, a railroad or, like, some kind of, like, just bar spacer because he was, like, a train technician or engineer or something right <laughs> that was his thing that's why he got like uh, the lantern is because he was quite literally like some tr dude train guy it's like I don't jordan know. test pilot for super cool planes john stewart military sniper alan scott whistle boy okay planes. now now really quick <laughs> kyle rayner's the lamest he's literally a struggling artist hey, like come on come on have the best minds though at Calder. the I would say not. I would say false. I would say false. Coming up with, uh, you know. Yeah, I don't. I don't know if that's actually true. Um, I'm not an artist. I know. Mm. If I was Could, a Green Lantern, couldn't I tell. Wouldn't be able. To, they say like, in a few comics, they've said like the more detailed your construct is, the more powerful it is. So that's why John Stewart's so good because he's he became he was like in the military but he became like an architect, and so he's used to like very fine tuned drawings of uh, structures and stuff. Speaking of structures, we're playing on oh yeah we're in I guess a uh, airport here, but uh, yeah so like John Stewart like when he builds a sniper rifle construct, it's like down to he like, knows like, the inner and, workings yeah like, yeah. The, like the muzzle brake like all of it's like absolutely you know how it would be um whereas like i'm sure if like kyle rayner makes like a boxing glove he probably doesn't even bother to like lace it up or anything he's probably just like eh, it's shaped like this and so i don't know though i yeah. honestly don't read a ton of stuff i liked the crossover with the question back in the day what are your figures in starting area soon I'm trying to figure out the best way to defeat you, Calder. Oh, how dare you? How dare you? I, I, I am so not in love with his rollouts, by the way, guys. I'm, I'm going to do my best to not complain the entirety of this game. This is a more fair matchup, and I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm pretty down for it. I'm going to be real with you. I'm going to try some stuff. I'm going to see if these moves pay off. Okay, so really quick, the orange. Yeah, yeah. Let's get into that. Y'all are seeing this beautiful, um, these arrows. So you can see there are thicker lines and then there are arrows that go the direction. So this is an airport. If you've been inside an airport, you know they have a moving walkway. At the beginning of each turn, uh, each character completely occupying a moving walkway square that can't use the flight ability must be placed in, the, in this area one square closer to the thick orange line of this area. The placement starts with the character closest to the thick orange line. So 
basically, they're going to be moving exactly how you think. If they're going this way, they move this way, and they just take one square at a time at so, the beginning of your turn. And if it's this way, they go this way. If Nightcrawler like hypersonics out, like let's say he goes 13 squares to here, and then he ends his movement right there, at the beginning of my turn, he's going to move one square there. I'm Correct. Slightly further away, or slightly closer, depending on how I want to do it. It's this really cool, like, ghetto sidestep <laughs> the map is sort of giving us. Yeah. It's neat. It's neat. And I fully plan to use it. So, Simeon, you won map. We got our sideline set up. I'm starting with normal Beast Boy. By all means, take us away. All right. Let's see here. I didn't bother looking at speed values, so I'm going to do that real quick. Mm -hmm. I know I've got idea. A, lot of, a lot of leap climb stuff. Nightcrawler just straight up uh, ignores the effects of terrains and characters for movement. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, and he can use the carry ability. So we'll start off with Nightcrawler since he can do that. And he's got 14 speed. Uh, he's going to go 1, 2. I'm going to measure it since I don't have to. I can go anywhere because I don't have to measure any terrain. Uh, we'll go 13 squares. I think. Yeah, yeah. Pretty sure. I don't see a reason not to do that. <laughs> Other than maybe getting swarmed right away. Uh, let's see. Combat reflexes, super senses. Uh, you've only got a few range, guys. I'm going to play it slightly safer than that. I'm going to go here with Nightcrawler. And carry Wolfsbane to right there. No hypersonic with that carry, just the old normal. Okay. Um, All right. 600 point game. We've got six actions. I surprisingly have zero leadership. Peter Parker is going to walk. Hmm. Somewhere. I think I have zero leadership as well, honestly. Eight squares. It's a fast little Peter Parker. Uh, he'll go. He'll go seven and then one into that hindering. Okay. Peter, uh, let's see. Bombastic Bagman really wants to get up there too, so he's gonna go nine squares out. He'll go right next to Wolfsbane. Groot is the slowest of the lot at uh, six speed, most of his dial. Uh, going down to a 5, a 0, and then a 4. So he's going to go 6 squares. He's giant size, so he'll also ignore stuff. He's going to land on that treadmill. Mm. He's gonna there you go. Treadmill, treadmill so, not, so not a treadmill. A moving walkway. It is. If you've been to an airport... I mean, it's a... It's, it's an escalator on treadmill. the ground. It's not... Okay. <laughs> Alright, Puma and... Dakin are the last two. Dakin also has Leap Climb, so he's also going to make it to the uh, treadmill. Mm. I'm gonna go right yeah, the treadmill goes like the opposite direction you want to go. It's a workout. This like literally makes it easier for you to walk. It's an opposite treadmill. Oh, are you supposed to go on the one that's going your direction? You mean forward? Like, if I'm walking forward, yeah, I want the one that's going forward. Uh, so if I'm going north, I want the one that's also going north. Is that why people are, like, mad if you're facing the opposite way? Because I, I always go on the opposite way. I thought it was for, like, workouts if you were waiting for your flight. All right, see, now I know this is a joke. Because I was like, because you really not know what I'm, like, I'm moving. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, it's for your workout. They have yoga rooms, and I'm just like, yo, just give me a gym room. Give me some 50 pounds, 30 pounds, whatever you got. Like, if someone can take a yoga class, I can get a pump before I get on the plane. All I'm saying is, you know, obviously there's no shower, and they might not, like, want sweaty me on their plane <laughs> for for the next three hours. Uh, sorry, is that your turn? Yeah, that's it. No, go that's, ahead. Okay. Continue with the sweaty calder getting on a plane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's great. 
I've got some awesome air, airport stories. I, I will not. I will, however... I prefer weights in the plane uh, so that I can do, like... Ah, uh, it's a safety issue, though. And just, like, Definitely. slam them down. Like, uh, today's a max day. So just, like, dude, chuck them at the window, man. I'm doing... Yeah. <laughs> See what happens. That's resistance training. Resistance hours. training. Uh... <laughs> Okay, Beast Boy's got Leap Climb. I don't think any of your guys have stat modifiers, do they? Uh, there is, I mean, there's like a single perplex. Uh, there's combat reflexes on a few. Uh, there's okay. com, uh, close combat expert on several. But uh, no, not really like stat modifiers. All right, so we're going to Leap Climb Beast Boy 8 to there. He'll get a token. And so will the T-Rex as we will be... Uh, swipping him, swatching him, whatever, out for the T Rex there. All right, and then we got Guy Gardner, both the lanterns. They got some sweet, sweet carry. So I think we're gonna want to, you know, play it a little, little safe here. Let's see. I know, I know, Guy's got a twelve, so he's an eleven. He's got to carry his girlfriend. So one, two, three. I think I'm going to go there. I'm going to go ahead and put Miss Ice there. And then Nightmaster is in hindering terrain. I want to get him all up in this treadmill as well. Because Nightmaster is just the worst. I do so he's going to have to move four. My treadmill to move me forward was closer. And yours is like the opposite side. Yes. I enjoy that. Yes, I also could have picked side. We didn't apparently. So, do whatever. Want, do you want to switch sides right now? No, it's not. No, we already started the game. Twelve actions in. But you just, you just not twelve actions. Excuse you. Um. All right. Let's uh. Let's move the other. Let's move old Barry Allen and his his good JSA friend. He's got ten, so you can move nine. Let's go ahead. Let's park him there. Put put Barry there. That's one, two, three, four. So we have to move old Raggy, old Miss Doll here. Let's see. How far she, can she move? Probably something sad. Something nine. Okay. She'll, she'll move there for right now. And I will say it is your go. Okay. Just double checking to see uh, how much beautiful beautiful uh willpower i have on this team ah it's as i thought is it is it a good one? it is a solid zero willpower now that i now that i i do like i have quite a few people with indomitable which i am a fan of green lantern guy gardner um That's surprising those, i don't think those, they normally yeah. get that yeah I don't, I don't think green lanterns normally get uh indomitable ever I will move my night nurse. She's got six squares she can go, so she's just going to walk up to nowhere. I think this is hindering here, so she'll stop in that. Uh, she'll yes. go right there. Um, Mr. Peter Parker will move four squares back. One, two, three, and four. Ah, oh, okay. I see what you're doing here. Click two. Yeah. Suddenly, I have a perplex, and... That's okay with me. Uh, man, I think I'm going to perplex up. I really want Dakin to be around for a while since he shuts off uh, shape change within six squares. So I like how you just want to take away. You have all, literally almost all the rollouts in the game. And you're like, I have to take away his <laughs> yeah, for sure. Calder doesn't need those. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to perplex up Dakin's defense. Um, this, oh, this is the balance I of life. The most important thing at the beginning of the turn. No, your turn, beginning of the turn is over. You move. Every you move. You turn is over. I was thinking that, and I'll no, no, totally. It's, it's map rules, Calder. That supersedes scumbag. all actions that can Fine. happen. I'll let I'll let it pass. Map rules what? supersede <laughs> your feelings, Calder. I don't know if you know this. Um. Uh, I thought, thought Hierakus rules bend to my will. My feelings at any given point, I'm allowed to change the game rules. That hurts my feelings. I want to 
I guess okay. uh, Wolfsbane also didn't have an action, so... She was carried, that's correct. Uh, eight speed with stealth. And I know your Alan Scat can uh, see through that, so... Back down, boy! One, two... Let's see here. I would still like to get into stealth. Um, so I could, I could get like six, seven, and then right there. Tie those guys up, potentially. Uh, that. Not a... Wolfsbane isn't my biggest threat, but she is a solid uh, defensive piece. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna tie up Mr. Chainsaw and Mr. Flashy Flash oh. as best I can. Okay. I do not have plasticity, but uh, mm -hmm. you know, it is what it is. So Dakin's defense perplexed up. Everyone else clears. Nothing free for me to do. Uh, Puma wants to get into the battle. He won't okay. clear him, though. Okay, there he goes. He cleared. All right, yeah. You want to uh, so punch No leadership. Uh, First of all, we move the T-Rex. We move <laughs> Nightmaster. Thank you to all the people that voted. By the way, for Beast Boy, we had Ethan B, Ben Jones, and um, Malcolm Rush vote for Beast Boy. Had the most votes here. Three three consecutive votes. People wanting Beast Boy and all his transformations. Uh, so he gets to move one real quick, which is nice. I think Guy Gardner can't use Close Combat Expert since he has an action token, which is a huge like bummer for me. But I also, you know, I'm not terribly worried um, we're still we're still on eleven for four, which is solid. The only bad part is is like you're a nineteen, which really sucks. Heal you. So we'll the the T Rex. Oh, how does outsiders? I think I need line of fire to you. I don't think. Um, I have to hit you with Alan Scott first, and then I can get rid of your combat reflexes. Is how that goes. That I believe. True. Yes. Well, you so that's. Get rid of it. Yeah, you would just lock my combat well, values. I would like combat values. Yeah, if I wanted to move to the other Beast Boy and then do whatever in such a fashion, I could, yes. So I think we're going to have Alan Scott. I think it's semi-pointless to move What's-Her-Face with us and or move Barry Allen. So I'm, I'm just going to have Alan Scott. He's going to running shot to here. And we're going to go ahead. We're just going to straight-up shoot her. So it's a 10 to 17. You have shape change. Oh, you know what? Yeah, wait a second. We gotta move. We cannot be here. We we can move where we have more targets. Uh, you don't have any move and attack, except for Nightcrawler, who can bring me places. And Puma. With a very short charge. Yes, yeah, so let's move. What's my range? Really quickly on... This guy's got eight, and he has five. So one, two, three, four, five. So we can't move there, first of all. So one, two... Three, four. Oh, I can. I can totally move there. Five. Then I have eight range. So if I don't get her, try targeting him, him, Groot, him, him. Yeah, I can see everybody. All right, cool. So roll for her so shape change. Are we ruling that Alan Scott negates stealth or that he sees through hindering? Oh, that's a good question. Let's see. What does it say it specifically? Says that, it says something about stealth. I ignore stealth. So I don't see through hindering. I ignore stealth. I'm actually. So I would have to draw a line of fire through hindering. So you would be an 18. Would you? Like, yeah. Would you say that? Hey, like ignore the. You would get the bonuses. Okay. I would imagine. Yeah. I mean, to nowadays it would just be sees through hindering. Right. But, but uh, it, he just says he stealth, not hindering terrain. So you would still get normal hindering, but like bonus. We'll see how my. That's the final. On the werewolf goes. Yes, for my action. All right, so I have to target somebody. Else. That is a shame. Um, that is I'll a try to system. target. Groot, since he has uh, a reducer, oh, and I have pen blast. Dare you. He's also giant sized. He will also shape change. Here is another five for you. Oh, that's okay. okay. Very cool. What do I need to hit Groot here? He's got an 18. Uh, he is not in hindering, and he's giant. So. That's what I like to see. Oh, that's so not what I like to see. We'll need much more than that. <sighs> Very much not a fan of that. We're going to have. Barry Allen here try to hypersonic speed breakaway. Ah, <laughs> this game <laughs> is already 
This <laughs> sucks. You, so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is unfair. Your last this is unfair. Two rolls. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right. We're going to have ice uh, incapacitate. Let me see if I can see him. We want to stop. We're going to try. I think it's we have to do Spider-Man. We can't see Nightcrawler. We're going to try to incapacitate Spider-Man, uh, the bombastic bag man. I don't think you have a rollout for the bombastic bag man. So we're going to... He has, I mean, he has super senses, but yeah, you'll make the attack first. Wow, there's the 11. Very close. Okay. Very cool. Thank you, Ice. That was, you see, that was very cool. A blue action token. Blue action uh, token. Yeah. And Wait, we're going to clear. Did I not clear Groot? Why has he got a red action? Okay. Yeah, he shouldn't have anything. Weird, he also didn't carry anybody with Groot, I find. Or can he not use. True, but he has six speed. So he would oh, sure. be moving like real Sorry, slow. Crazy slow. We're going to clear everybody else with the reds. And it is your go. All right. First, I'm going to check and see if it's worth oh. it to push the Nightbane. Wolfsbane. Man. Nightbane. Wolfsbane. Uh, no, it is not Man. worth it. Uh, let's see. What a could mega I, bummer. Could I carry the T-Rex if I hit it? Is it is it possible? Nightcrawler's I think... speed says... But you can uh, use carry ability, right? A target hit by a close combat attack may be placed adjacent to Nightcrawler after. So you're not carrying me, you're yeah. placing me. So, so yes, I would say you can. That's that's kind of fun. That's Please nice. don't kill my T Rex. He's uh, <laughs> first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna move everybody on the conveyor belt. There you go. One Thank you for listening forward. to the rules. Um Mr. Pedro Parker. Man. There's just so many options in this 600-point game. I have a ton of cool guys. I'd really like Groot to do something at some point, but he's a little bit out of range. I think I'm going to throw him one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think I'm going to throw Mr. Groot right in the middle of everything. Jeez, I hate it so much, man. As, as my first action, we'll do that. This sucks. Uh, Not a fan. Let's go after. Let's go after Alan Scott with uh, Nightcrawler. Bro, so leave me be. He's gonna go. He's got a fourteen speed. He's gonna go five squares down. Okay. And then I'll probably end here. So we'll go mm, five. Okay. Okay. Because I ignore characters, so I'm gonna I'm gonna place there anyhow. So five, you ignore five, everything. Five. Yeah. Let's get that right. Yeah. You ignore everything for movement purposes. We'll go, we'll go right right here. One, two, three. Yeah, mm -hmm. right there. Okay. Um, I just need to see if I hit. So Nightcrawler is to... a 10. Okay. Um, Scott is a... 17. A 17. So I need a 7. That'll not hit. So I'll just do I'm that. Okay with that. I'm okay with that. Uh, I was hoping that I could double... Dakin and Puma you. Uh, mm. but that's fine. Dakin does have Leap Climb. He should probably get somewhere, do something. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. Uh, Peter's still just going to perplex up Dakin's defense for now. He's still outside of your... T-Rex has giant reach, right? Yeah. So he's still outside of your giant reach. Um, so you'd have to switch to like bear mode to attack me. Puma will just walk his sad six squares. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. He'll get off the conveyor belt. Oh, sure. Enough of this. Yeah, he's tired of this ride, Mr. Bones. Uh, Mr. Really, for how a conveyor belt works, I mean, you don't just stand there and like let it slowly. Like you can walk on the thing. Like you should like modify your speed, like double it. Yeah, because that's how it feels to me. Because like, you yeah. zoom past people that are just on the ground. I mean, if I, I think it's assuming it's like free, so it's assuming you're just like you like move to it and then you just stand there. Just stand there, yeah. People do move slow. They do. I mean, they do. Me. 
I always stand there, but then there's always people that are like, I have a place. I got places to be. And they, people in the airport are some of the rudest people in the world. I get it. Like, they don't even want to be there. No one really wants to be there. So it's something they have to do to get to place to place. To me, but, it, it feels kind of like an act. Like, this like guy's like, I'm in the airport. I need to be mad and in a hurry. I'm like, but you don't. You can just wear yeah. sweatpants and just chill. Show exactly. You're two hours early. My my favorite out. time in the airport is when I had an eight hour an eight hour layover, and I like whatever. I took out my computer and I played video games with this awful airport internet. But still, like, I don't care. I'm not gonna be mad about it. Anyways, sorry. Play your game. This we're gonna ramble about airports because of this map. All right, that's that's all I got. That cleared it up. So, yeah, three all actions, right. and then everyone else clears. I like how number one, you say, oh, he's gonna have to switch to bear mode. But you move Puma within his giant reach too, oh, no. and then also at the beginning of the game Did or being turn, oh, I also right. move yeah, these yeah. guys here, so I could hit everybody if I wanted to. That's true. Which except my let's... yeah, I can't hit Nightcrawler, but I can target all these guys, and I can do what I like to call chomp, which is what I've been waiting to do this entire time. Uh, first of all, let me see if there's any better choices. I believe you said. Uh, is it Dakin's defense is perplexed up, or is it Puma's? Yeah, Dakin's. Dakin's. So they Dakin's. they all have shape change except for Bombastic Bagman, right? Uh, Dakin does not have shape change. He's got Dakin doesn't. Senses. He has super senses. Yeah, cheese. These roll has super senses. Uh, Puma is the one with both. Yes. I think what I'm going to try to do is with Guy Gardner. I want to go with the one shot, the one shot kill. On this this uh, wolf Spain here, and I'm 11 for four, but she has a 19 defense, and I really don't trust my dice. So I think I'll just try to like cripple you as much as I can, type of deal. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna try. Combat expert. It's not a free action, but oh, I just get just, it. So I have zero. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just right. close combat expert. Let me double check, because if it's a free action, close combat expert, he's way better. Than I thought he was gonna be. Uh, no, I shouldn't use close combat. Yeah, I can just use it. So I'm going to try to use Close Combat Expert targeting Wolf Spain. Let's see what her shape change says. I don't have to declare what I put it into until I choose a target. So, All right. Shape change says... No. It's not even in the thing yet. What are you talking about? No. That was a two. Did it not oh okay. Yet? Sorry, it's not loading for me yet on my end. So it's a two. Okay. Yeah, it popped up as a two. Um, let's let's try to roll seven. We'll be at twelve for five with guy. Oh my gosh! So lucky, so lucky. I chose to do that. All right, you get senses. Yeah, your attack has not loaded on my screen yet either. Oh, sorry. It is a six and a one. People okay. can call me a liar. They want uh, to. There it is. Okay. Yeah. Super sense it says. Also a two. Okay, so how much am I Baby. Taking? Uh five damage from Guy five Gadna. Damage. That'll put Wolf's Bane on one, two, three, four, five. Dead. No, just kidding. What? I'm click six. Okay. Click six. Very solid. Very solid. I'm okay with that. But that the worst part of that sucks that that is still a trait. So she's still like no push. She still has like combat reflexes and super senses. Yeah, she lost super or shape change. Uh, she did go up to a which three is, damage, though. Which is pretty nice. All right, so we did that. That's cool. We're going to have Beast Boy do the chomp now, for sure. He's okay. he's going to chomp targeting uh, Bombastic Bagman, Puma, and Dakin. If he can target them all, I guess you shape have to change, roll shape change. Puma. All right. Okay, let's go ahead. And do 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 do. do. I forgot. Uh, I need, is doing uh, maintenance tonight at eleven thirty. At eleven thirty. So is that like eight o'clock our time? When is that going to happen? I, it's yeah. it is slowing down. I see. Yeah, I just noticed sure. that it uh, popped up. Yeah. Like an error message. But uh, uh, so be give a close combat action. You can target up to three characters, and then I just divide damage, and I can reroll my attack value when I target more. Okay, so let's go. Let's target all of them. Rolling it. I rolled two fours and eight. So I'll hit everybody. 19. Oh, and I'll nice. decide how, to, how I want to deal the damage here. We'll go... Well, first we'll roll Super Senses on Dakin. Dakin. Okay. And then on Bombastic Bagman. 
Ah, so Dakin is taking all damage that you want to deal. What about Puma? Puma rolled shape change. Oh, he did? Okay, yeah, so Dakin just takes four then. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, that'll put me on click five. Sadly, not a regen click. Mm, that's okay. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Uh, click five. Yes. Worst part about plasticity, she doesn't ignore characters, so I'm gonna just have to like place her somewhere, which is very, it's not great. Um, I can also choose to place her maybe someplace that could really mess stuff up. We're gonna have, um, I don't want the Flash to push though. Okay, I was gonna have him push to just try to like take out Wolfsbane, get rid of her, hopefully not worry about her. Uh, we are going to definitely move up Nightmaster. What is Dakin looking like for stats right now? Dakin on click five. He is. Because I feel like we're definitely going here with Nightmaster. Seven leap climb, nine special attack. Uh, okay. 16 defense with super senses and one damage with close combat expert. Okay. Close combat. Ooh, close combat expert. One damage though, so I'm not. I'm not worried about that. Uh, so we'll go ahead. We'll move Night Master to there. It's our third action this turn, and yes, then I want to move. Is perplexed up, so he is a 17 technically. Oh, sure. Um, I kind of built knockback. I guess I don't think that would have affected anything. Three, four. Nah. Nah. So we're way too. We're too far gone to deal him knockback. Now, let's go ahead. I want Ragdoll to get into the fight, but there's not a lot of spaces she can go um, that's, like, useful. So she'll just move. Let's go there. Maybe her plasticity will stop some things. Do you ignore characters as well for Nightcrawler? Do you ignore characters and terrain? So I guess her plasticity does not even affect you, I guess. Yeah, Nightcrawler says... Uh ignores the effects of terrain and character oh sure and she does like nothing so she'll just she'll just tie only puma down i guess we'll clear ice uh barry allen and green lantern and it is your go okay let's see i think guy gardner's my biggest and eh, maybe alan scott I guess Alan Scott's kind of annoying me right now. Uh, let's see. First things first. I'll move Nightcrawler back one square because of the, the treadmill thing. Um, let's see here. Groot has a 10 for 4. What is Alan Scott's defense? Uh, it is a 17. Impervious, baby. Impervious. Bro. That I like. I have, like, the one rollout stacked with a damage reducer, where I don't think anyone on your team can do penetrating damage, right? No, yeah. Which is, so it's so weird, right? I only really have one person with a reducer, and then Beast, I guess, has toughness, and then I guess Nightmaster has toughness, but um, I have all these weird ways of doing pen damage, like exploit weakness, and all this other stuff, but only Groot has yeah. a reducer on your team, no one else. And then same thing, like, I only have, like, one dude with a big reducer on my team. Um, your rollouts haven't been as dominant as I thought. I think roll 20 does still hate yeah. you. Like, it still has, like, that scroll shape change effect is happening in this game a little bit. No, well, I kind of figured that uh, the rollouts would, like, only work so long. Like, it's only, I mean, even though it's a, what, like a 33% chance. Yeah. Um, it's not exactly, like, it doesn't stack to, like, a 66% chance. Oh, yeah, like. right. Um, so it's not, like, 100% foolproof. Uh, Peter Parker is going to walk up a few squares okay, so that he can perplex down Guy mm. Gardner's defense. Okay, okay. So that'll be my action one. Action two, Wolfsbane will attack Guy Gardner. Oh, okay. A nine into something. For it's a 16 now for close, yeah. Right. I need a seven for potentially three. Mm. Mm. That's okay. Spain tried. Uh, Groot will then push to swing. Ooh. So he's got a 10. On guy? Okay. Yeah, on guy. So I need So a, now a you six. need a 6. Now you need a 6. There it is. So For how much? Do 4 damage. Ooh, so you need to click 5. Yikes. Big ol' yikes for Gardner there. Go to click 
three with Groot, or er, clip two. <laughs> That's how pushing works. Um, Dakin's got close combat expert. Uh, what is, what is, uh, what, who's that guy? Nightmaster. What is his, uh, defense looking like? Oh, oh baby. Nightmaster. He is a 17 tough. 17 toughness. All right. Dakin's going to go ahead and put both into, he's going to use close combat expert, put both into damage. Ooh, okay. Go nine into the seventeen. Need all right for potentially three damage. Mm. Uh, wouldn't have mattered mm. anyhow, so that's fine. Um, bombastic bagman didn't pick up an object, so he's only at two damage. He's got two damage, super strength. We'll go ahead and try and hit. Try and hit the old uh, carpet man. Nightmaster. Nightmaster? The yeah. stair stairway guy? <laughs> we'll try and hit him with Bombastic Bagman. If you would have had uh, Deadpool, you would have, we'd have two staircase people hey. in the in the game. Yeah. He's on like a sort of a staircase, stair-step deal. Ooh, that'll hit. How much do I take from Bombastic Bagman? Uh, so he's got a printed two damage. Ah, so I take one, and I go to click two, and then you take one, and you go to click two. And then you take one. Because you dealt me with mm -mm. what and from an attack? No, <laughs> get out of here. I, I do know it says from an attack. It no, was... no. All right, let's get this straight. <laughs> no, so no. Uh, does but okay, my super I like your strength to knock you back, or is there just a T Rex in the way? Uh, there's a, there's a T Rex <laughs> character. Point. You didn't even put out objects. You had a character with super strength. You didn't put out a heavy object. Could have yeah. slapped me for I way more. One, two, three, four, five. Simmons. Simmons. Uh, Night Nurse is going to run somewhere. What is she looking like? The only character on my team with willpower. Beautiful. Uh, what a beautiful lady. Six the only is it Night Nurse? Yeah. Bro. Uh, what's her face? On uh, Netflix. I can't remember her name. And I feel bad. But she's coming in clutch. She was the Night Nurse, though. Um, uh, Claire? Something like that? Yeah. Claire. Yeah. The one that, like, uh... Yeah, like yeah. stabbed Daredevil in the stuff. chest and like gave him some air or whatever. And yeah, yeah. Yeah. She helped everybody. She helped everybody. She was the she was the glue that held them more or less together. I don't so yeah, is that it? Is that the? Yeah, I don't think I want to push. No. Home, uh, no? Um, yeah, I definitely. <laughs> no balls. So, no balls. Uh, we'll clear <laughs> everyone else on the team. Uh, All right. Yeah. Anybody's uh, anybody's stats up right now? Uh, no, I perplexed down. Guy Anybody's, uh... So. Ooh, okay. No, no this is my defense, though. So I now have, uh, Flurry, Battle Fury, Blade. So when, when Wolf's Mane doesn't have Shape Change, but still has Super Senses, I have Battle Fury, which is great. Um, but Flurry is cool, making two attacks, which I, I enjoy. Um, and maybe if she dodges out of the, you know, one of them. And I have a three damage with it, so I can totally choose to just, like, Flurry Groot... And get him off some stuff here. That's very true. Which is which is cool. You know, but I'm not in love with uh, with where I'm where I'm at. Also, we can incapacitate Groot, which is cool with um, ice, which I would dig. Um, personally, I prefer Groot wasn't there because now would be the time to incapacitate Spider Man and deal him a damage without getting hurt. Type yeah. of deal. That would be huge. Going after my bombastic bag. So, yes, man. Yes, I want to take out your bombastic bag as quickly as possible. Um, I'm Right now, I'm trying to figure out if I... I think I have to move the T-Rex. I think I have to. So I'm going to. I don't want to, but I think I have to um, with the map. I, I think my feelings, once again, don't supersede the map bonus. I got a lot of actions. We got a lot of stuff we can do here. I am going to have... Let's just, I think, because Alan Scott has the best chances of getting rid of Wolf's Bane. Um, but I also just maybe just want Guy Gardner to flurry really quickly to get Groot off of that. So we're going to have Guy Gardner. The only bad thing about flurry is I have to give one to Wolf's Bane for sure. Mm -hmm. And then I have to worry about Groot. And I don't want to do that. I want to just, like, I would rather deal Groot too uh, to get rid of him. So let's have 
the flash. I have to break away first if I want to hit her, or I could just like punch her right now. Um, yeah, let's have Flash just punch her. Let's have Flash just he'll just keep it simple, stupid, and he'll just punch her. So, what is her defense right now? She's a fifteen, but with combat reflexes and super senses. Very cool. That will hit a nineteen. Ah, uh, killing, is, is killing Wolf Spain. I so now I, I'm cool with that. So now. Guy Gardner will flurry on Groot. He is sadly... Uh, did you perplex up Groot at all? I don't I think so. So he's okay. a 17. 17. And shape change, but... No shit, yeah, because battle here. So. He's still an 18, okay. Yeah. So I need a 9 to hit this dude. Uh, we have a flurry on it with Guy. So we're going to roll first attack, 6, whiffs it. Second attack, 7, whiffs it. That's the way it be sometimes. That sucks. Um, so that was my only guy who could get rid of, like, ignore your shape change to, like, try to deal you some damage. We're going to have Alan Scott running shots. Uh, I think we're going to go to here. And we're going to try, we'll try to go for Groot. I guess where we were, let's just go. Uh, yeah, I don't want to. Yeah, let's, let's try to target Groot. Okay. I see how it is. Okay. You may. Let's, uh, let's, let's blast him. Ah, 16 misses, for sure, which sucks. Uh, that really sucks. Maybe could be using Alan Scott as more of a TK piece. Might not be a terrible idea right now. Um, that's one, two, three. Let's have Ice incapacitate Groot. That's what she'll try to do. I cannot roll a shape change, so go ahead. Oh, there it is. Ice with the 11s. The 11s on incap. Ice, That's ice, baby. Quick three. Man, she's killing it. Okay. Uh, and then let's have... Let's do another chomp. I think I'll push to chomp with the tier. I really dig chomp, and I want to do it as many times as possible. I like it a lot. I'm still an 11 for four. I'll still be an 18 tough after all this is said and done. Right. I I want to chomp. Uh, so we're... Shape open. change on Puma. Yes. No cool. There. Uh, everyone still has super senses, so... Sweet. Um, it's a 9, so that hits 20. Okay, so we'll go Dakin first. Dakin first. That's no-go. Okay. Bombastic Bagman. That's no-go. And Puma. Puma is mm, safe. Can't do it to Puma. I think um, I could split it 50-50, but then I'll take two. So I'll take one already, and then one, two again. Uh, and I don't know if I'm in love with that. So what I think we're going to do... I dealt all four to Dakin first, right? Yes, he's on click five. I'll do two and two. Okay. I'll do two and two, and I'll t I'll go to, I'll take a push, go to click two, and then go to click four because of Spider Man's ability. That'll KO Dakin, and that'll put nice. Bombastic Bagman to click three or no four, because uh, he was on click two for hitting uh, your Sword Man. Nah, nice. And then I will clear Red Tokens, which is Nightmaster and Regdoll, and it's your turn. even check but I think uh -huh, uh -huh. defenders x-men okay I have a wild card with bombastic bagman um, so he could copy defenders or something but uh, we'll just leave it as is for now uh, what is the what, what is this lady what is she, the what is that uh, ragdoll? Yeah. Ragdoll. Ragdoll. Uh, My only rollout. Defense. Babe, she's a 16. Super senses, and she's got shape change, baby. Super senses, shape change. Uh, Puma would rather blades that than deal with anything else right now. So, I think we're gonna... She's a 17? Uh, she's a 16. Last I checked. Let me see if it changed. I would like it to change. No, still a 16. Okay. Peter Parker is going to pick a pail of perplexing up Puma's attack to an 11. Uh, so I'll try and I'll try and swing on you. I don't know. I'm pretty sure it goes through a uh, bombastic big man square. No, but you can look yeah, at there. You can look at that side yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. go for it. Middle. His attack to, to roll a five on this character. Okay, let's do yeah, shape change. I mean, 
you've got a you've got rollouts, so you got it. Okay, I don't I don't think I'm gonna get any of these rollouts. By the way, <laughs> I needed it. I needed it. Uh, that's a fifteen. That misses yeah. oddly enough. Wow. <laughs> yeah. He's... You you laughed, but I needed the, the perplex. Um. So that's one action. Oh man. I don't know if there's like anyone that's what's Guy Gardner's defense right now. Uh, so right now he is a 15 in vulnerability with old Guy Gardner. 15 in vulnerability. Okay. There's not really a whole lot I've got going on. Um, Nightcrawler. Is just gonna hypersonic down to good old Alan Scott here. Okay, here we go. And he's gonna go. Alan Scott. Oh wait, he's got impervious, right? I do have impervious, so I would reduce that beautiful two damage that you do. Yeah, so we're not gonna do that. We're gonna rewind that clock. Uh, there you we'll, go. We'll go ahead and go down. Let's you can go. damage Ragdoll and Ice. Yeah, let's go down to and... Ice. Okay. So we'll she is just a 17 with barrier. So, squares. beautiful barrier ability. I do love my girl Ice, though. She is awesome. Blam. Ooh, ooh, Simeon. A 14 does not hit. Ah, good. Wouldn't have even hit uh, Gardner. We'll go back to here. And That's, we'll fair. Car That's fair. That's uh, fair. Let's see here. Bagman, Peter, Groot's got a clear... Yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll clear Groot. Um, we'll yeah. clear Peter. We'll clear the bag man. Mm, the bag man. And we'll clear the... In the deep dog lair of the bag man. The very... Night nurse. Very sweet. Bag man's on click four. He's got a... He's going to be six clicks long, I imagine. Bag man can't be crazy deep. I don't. I just. I don't want to deal him more than I absolutely have to. Is my my thing? Because I'll, I'll I'll take that. And I definitely don't want to. And I definitely don't want. He is ninety points. So. Yes, he, he is ninety very points. Well be nine clicks deep. I think if anyone's gonna you know hit him, I'm gonna probably make it be on the night master. Um, because I don't I don't see a sense in wasting, uh, green lanterns and pervious clicks. His running shot on it and all that stuff. So we're gonna have Night Master. He's gonna go after Bagman, dude. So it is a ten on stuffs. Ooh, that'll hit. That hits a nineteen. These are some great rolls on my end. Super sensitive. Let's see how Simeon. Ooh, he answered it. Yeah, he saw he saw a problem with the rolls, and he definitely answered that problem. Let's go ahead and have Ragdoll now take a swing against Puma. She finally gets into the action. All right, Puma's still on click. Puma has shape change. Yeah, his rollouts have held, okay. held steady. So, Love how awful your mic sounds right now, by the way. Also, it's my favorite thing. Is it? Is it okay now? Yeah. He'll also make No, it's roll. super funny. All right, let's do it. Oh, well, scum. Son of a gun. Um, so that's those two. Not getting... Not getting the the hits they so well deserve. Peter Parker pushed a click to. I kind of just want to take him out. Uh, let's. Well, Groot right now is actually in perfect uh, killing time. I would say. Let's go ahead and just um. Groot doesn't get a hindering bonus because he's big. I can see him. Yeah, he's not in hindering yeah. specifically. So let's let's just shoot. Let's shoot Groot where he is. I think I'm in a pretty solid spot. No one's going to mess with me too much. Okay. But uh, I'll, I'll running shot down to here. Groot is, and we'll shoot. He's a 17 with invulnerability. These, I wasted that nine, attack, that nine swing with Spider. I rolled a four, so that's just awful. Not in love with that. Really wanted to deal a little bit more damage, I suppose. Um, That wouldn't hit anybody on your team anyways. I think we're going to have to clear the T-Rex, clear ice, clear guy, and then clear the flash. As much as I really don't want to be next to guy, I kind of have to take him out before I can mm. do anything solid with Groot. Uh, sure. First things first, we'll move Nightcrawler back one, Night Nurse up one. 
Ooh, Ooh look at that. Uh, let's see here. Puma doesn't really want to push. Groot's our only real attack this turn. So we'll go ahead and perplex Groot's attack up. Mm. And he's going to swing on Guy Gardner. So he is... On click three, he's an 11 with the perplex. So you need that four to hit. Uh, yeah. a, a four. A four. Um, that'll get it. For, for how much? For three damage. So I'll go... I'll reduce it by two. So I'll go to click six. And... Click six, I have lost Flurry, and I'm no longer a three damage. I am a two damage. With still with blades, but much worse. Bombastic Bagman does have Leap Climb. Mm. But he can't be healed by any way other than the Fantastic Four. Also, I just realized Bombastic Bagman also has Perplex. So he'll go ahead and Perplex down the T-Rex's attack. Oh, that hurts. And, that hurts. Uh, man, I don't know if he wants to Leap Climb away. What's Alan Scott's... What has he got going on? He's still top dial. He's still running shot, pen blast, TK, impervious, okay. 10 attack, 3 damage. He has not hit a single attack all this entire time. Uh, he also has incapacitate, I guess. I'll attempt to break away with Bombastic Bagman. Okay. So that I can tie up Alan Scott. Uh, do you have Leap Climb? I, I, I He seems like a guy who would have it. I do, but I still okay. fail on a 1, so... Oh, jeez. Uh, so all right. We'll just, uh, all right, that's fine that. with me. Um... Yeah, we'll just we'll just leave it there. We'll clear Puma, clear Nightcrawler, okay. and that'll be your go. So you perplex down the T Rex's attack, right? Yes. With so the T Rex Bagman. is the only character that has any form of prob. He can reroll his own attack. So we're gonna chomp with the T Rex. You know, targeting. Can I charge? Is this, is this a close? No, I'm not click four. I, I've skipped right past my click of charge. Uh, we're going to chomp at the T-Rex, try to target Puma and Bombastic Bagman. All right. Shape change on Puma. All right. You are allowed to do this. Um, That will hit 16s. Does that hit them both? 16s. Uh, Puma's still top dial, so he's a 17. And Bombastic Bagman, he is a 16. Um, I could just, I could just take the L, you know, deal him to, or I could try to re-roll it. I think, uh, I think we'll just go try to kill Bombastic Bagman, get him out of here. Alright, super yeah. senses. Senses. Uh, yeah. Okay. Nice. He is out of there. Nice. How much damage then, are you taking? I am, I'm, a, I have to deal you, th uh, three, right? Yeah, so... Uh, it's when he so I die. I also attack, die. Deal attack or penetrating damage equal to the damage taken. Um, damage taken. Like yeah. So I can't. Twice. I can't choose to divide my damage. But yeah. I can't. I mean, I can't choose to divide my damage to two to you and zero to nobody. I don't think right. So I think I just I die. I, otherwise, I wouldn't want to do that. But yeah. Um. So Beast Boy's out. Uh. He got rid of whatever all that stuff and i only really use the t-rex i'm sorry if you like the bear or the cheetah but like the t-rex is like clearly the best stats wise he's awesome and chomp is cool as heck so i, I hope you guys at least enjoy the t-rex there um guy's got a flurry you still have invulnerability ice has been killing it with these in caps so we're gonna have ice incapacitate Groot. oh baby oh my gosh she hits an 18 i love it is that a group? Is an 18 hit group? Yeah, so he'll go to click four now. Uh, yeah. Mm. And he'll take another action token. All right. That is cool. That is cool, cool, cool. Guy Gardner now. I think we can't. We don't have Flurry. Click four. One, two. All right. We are going to have Guy try to mess you up here, seeing what we can do. Um, or we can just move. Nah, nah, nah. We'll have Guy try to punch you. We'll have Guy punch you. It's a 9. Oh, it's a 17. That'll hit for how much damage? Let's let's try Blades. For 6 damage. 
Jeez, so that'll hit me for five. So, because I have toughness on that click. So okay. One, two, three. Oh, that's six four, on blades. Great. Five, There's that chainsaw. Nine. Oh, click nine. So you know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. We buy. We bypassed the only time Simeon got to see that nineteen impervious was on his way to click nine. Um, if memory serves, you have uh, Earthbound neutralized and Shape Change right now, right? That is correct. Okay, we're gonna have Flash. Yeah. We're gonna have Flash Hypersonic. Moving one, two, three, four, whatever. I ignore characters when Hypersonic, right? I can stop whenever I want to, or do I have to stop? I don't think so. I think I can. I yeah, stop there. Right? I don't have plasticity or anything. All right, let's go ahead and roll Shape Change. Oh, oh baby. Oh, baby. Flash. Don't crit miss. Does a 15? I think a 15 hits. I think it's a crazy yeah, low defense. I got defense. a 14. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Man. All right. Um, and then we can finish it. I don't even know where we would, like, go. Like, where really matters. Um, so, yeah, let's just, let's just move down to there. That was one, two, three. One, two, three, four. Uh, we're going to clear Nightmaster and clear Ragdoll. And then, Al, Scott, it's your turn. Let's... This game has swung a wildly different in the direction I thought it was going to. I mean, it's always been in your favor if you look at the KO zone. Uh, that is true. That I is have, true. Yeah, I, I managed to barely KO the T-Rex, and that was from you KOing me. So, uh, <laughs> we'll perplex down just because I have no real option here. We'll perplex down Ice's defense. Okay. And... I think Ice with the end cap is the most clutch. Obviously, a six on blades. That's what Tide grew up and ended up uh, KOing him. So yeah, uh, yeah. We'll go seven squares with Nightcrawler. Try and hit her. She's only at sixteen right now. She needs six. Jeez. Sweet. Jeez. I'll end up exactly where I was because ah uh, seven and seven. It's not fair. Uh, Puma's gonna try and blades on uh, Nightmaster or Night. Okay, Night going Master. for Nightmaster. Uh, I still have a Nightmaster. Team. Nightmaster. Does a fifteen hit? Probably not. That's cool. Well, am I on click <laughs> two? So did I go down two click? I did not. I'm a sixteen. Yeah. Sad sadly. I didn't think you would take enough damage to go down that. Far. No. Um. Yeah, that's all I really have. So, all right, it's good. good We're gonna have, uh, great turn. Four Simeon, dice great rolls, eight, for amazing eight turn combined between four dice. Very nice, very nice. We're gonna running shot five to there, trying to target Nightcrawler with Alan Scott. Okay, uh, and he does have shape change, so he'll roll that first. Wow, wow. Mm. a single die. So, can go um, let's side. go for Peter Parker, then. Okay. He does not have shape change, so... That will hit an 18. Uh, pretty sure that hits... Uh, he's got a 17... 18 in hindering. Super Senses says... How much damage am I taking? Uh, you'll take 3. Okay, that'll take him from click 2 to click 5. Let's have we'll have Nightmaster try to get rid of this uh, this Puma schmuck, and we'll try to we'll try to mess him up here. Shape change. Okay. Attack roll. <laughs> uh, what is his attack? Uh, it is a nine, so it'll hit uh, sixteen. All right, I'm still a seventeen top dial. Okay, so that'll miss. Um, let's have our girl Ragdoll. Not as cool as I thought she would be. I liked her. Um, she's a nine for two. Let's have her try to attack. Shape change. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Ah, ah, there it is. Puma's gonna outlast everyone. Getting because, some decent uh, rollouts here. He started with two rollouts. Um, I mean, to be fair, Wolfsbane did too. She just got unlucky. Yeah, if I could nice transfer one, these rollouts six. to just attacks, I'd be solid. But uh... yeah, your your single d sixes are, uh, for the most part, slightly better. Not amazing. They would add up to higher attacks, though. We're going to clear the rest of the team, and I'm going to say it's your go. All right, sweet. I'm going to go ahead and first things first. Uh, let's uh, conveyor belt, baby. A, a power action. 
Ah, oh, okay. We'll, we'll get all swung him on some alter ego action. Get old uh, Spider Man in here on click four. Um, so I'm pretty sure alter ego says. Action tokens pushing damage, all transfers. So that is how that will happen. He will have an action token. He will have an action token. I should give him a blue one instead of red, since it's a new turn. Um, Night Nurse really has no purpose like here anymore, so uh, she's just going to walk all the way back here. Well, I kind of see, like, what you're sort of trying to do is, like, if Nightcrawler take, does take damage, he's always going back to her. Well, like, I, I was, yeah. But I was now you can move farther uh, back, because now Nightcrawler had, uh, wants to go farther back, for sure. If I had hit uh, Guy Gardner enough to kill him, or if Groot had just moved to Hindering, he could have healed up. Yeah. Um, he didn't really get a turn to do that, so the end right. cap really kept me from from a lot of the potential that I had. Ice, ice baby. Uh, I'll just clear Nightcrawler, because I like that 19. Yeah, no, that's, that's good. There's no reason to push off of it, so we'll clear Nightcrawler, clear Puma. Also, what does that Spidey look like? That Spidey? His, he's got, um, alt uh, ego starting line. Super senses, but evades on a 4 through 6, mm -hmm. and then once at the beginning of my turn, if he has no action tokens as a free action, he may place a web special terrain marker in his oh, Okay. Um, okay. Otherwise, he's got leap climb, super strength, and three damage. Ten attack, three damage, seventeen defense. Uh, Barry Allen is fourteen speed. Well, so we'll move. We'll move there with old Barry. Barry Allen, moving move twelve squares. Uh, to just slap the Night Nurse up. Hitting a 17. For how much? For three. Uh, going to click four. I see how it is. And then I think I just move one. I have two squares left. So I'll just move one out of Hindering Terrain. And then uh, I really don't care about Ragdoll's well-being. So we're going to push Ragdoll to try to get at Puma here. Bothers me. He's on top dial. Shape. Okay. Ooh, a 16. I know that misses. Yeah. No, he's got that 17 defense. She's she's gonna take a push for that. Let's um I don't wanna push a Nightmaster too much. I think mm, Guy has just such a low defense, it's it's pretty you know, you're within Ice's in cap range, and I think Ice is just the best. So we're gonna try to incapacitate you with Ice. Okay. Okay, so I think that misses. 17 with Henry Barnes? Yeah, I'm an 18 in Henry Barnes. Uh, yeah, there it is. Ice's first missed incapacitate roll of the of the game. Yeah, it's good. Um, guy can't carry her, sadly. He's a bad boyfriend. He has Battle Fury right now. He's too angry um, to help his lady friend out. Oh, I guess she also had ranged combat expert. I could have done that. It would have I mean, given you an extra token, but I could have pumped some stats. I forget she had range combat expert. All right, cool. Let's have this dude. He's going to... Three does not kill Night Nurse? Are you serious? What? Yeah. Wow. Wow. I thought she would have been she dead. Is, she is a um, named character. Fair. Let's running she's shot... Regular Nurse. She is Night Nurse. We're going to running, running shot to here. We're going to try to target Nightcrawler first with Alan Scott. Okay. GL. Shape change. Says no. Okay, let's. Uh, we're gonna go for Spider Man. Okay. Oh, that is no way that hits. Alan okay. Scott showing that he truly is the worst Green Lantern by missing, I think, every single attack roll this entire game. Um, and I don't think we're gonna push anybody else. We're gonna move guy up though. One, two, three, four, five. Seven. We can fly. So I feel like there's fine. Uh, we're blue this turn, and let's clear Night Master. And it is your go. Master of the Night. Night Master has cleared. All right. Guy has a some sort of reducer right now, right? He is a he is in vulnerability with an amazing fifteen defense right now. Okay. We're gonna start off with going after the flash. So we'll see mm. who the real speedster is. Uh 
Oh, in uh, implying Nightcrawler is a speedster. Yes, in a sort of a way. I mean, yeah, he's a teleporter. Uh, yeah. He's going to hypersonic. Okay. Three squares. Try and punch your flash. Okay. If he's got a 10 attack, he's still... I am an 18. Also. I am an 18. That's all right. I only need an 8. I've been rolling awesome. There's a 4. Mm. Sweet. I'll just crawl back. Oh! Halfway there! Whoa! Uh, let's see. <laughs> All right. Sorry. Sorry. All this. I'll go back over here. Mm. Who cares? <laughs> Crawler has <laughs> a single attack. Got a uh, got a flight to board. Puma's killer to try the and blades on your ragdoll. Okay. Shite change. Two. That might hit. She took a, <laughs> she took a push. That might hit. I no, it. still a sixteen. Yeah, a still a sixteen. <laughs> uh, nightmare so clear. Remember how you're telling um, me Puma's so good for his like he's still good for his points. Yeah, I, he hasn't. I mean, it's literally just my die rolls. It is your dice. It is just your dice. All these figures were great for. The I points. I will uh, agree. I have not made a single like decent attack yeah. really. Um, that's not true. I made at least one. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. Who should have went forward a square, by the way? Escal no, Moving. No, I didn't do it at the beginning of my turn call. <laughs> oh! So now my feelings, Matt, don't matter. Well, I guess they always don't matter. Uh, but all of a sudden, Matt doesn't intercede feelings nowadays. Oh, I see how it is. I might as well push this Spider-Man, but I'm not going to. I'm just. Oh, really? I was like, I thought you were going to for sure clear him, yeah. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> at this point, I might as well just push everyone every turn. Because, uh... I've literally KO'd one 60-point character. I think... And I don't even think I've damaged anyone else on your team except Guy Gardner. I'm going to go all 14 squares. There's got to be a faster way to do that. Oh, you don't ignore things? Huh. Clearly an inferior speedster. Yeah, okay. I'll go 12 squares to there. And try to roll on Nightcrawler here. Shape. Change. Uh, Ooh, I just said an 18, but I think you, you have a 19. Yeah, I'm a 19. Sir. I'm going to roll my Break away. anyhow, though. Don't get it, though. Okay. And then I can move two squares away. I will take a push for this. But I like this speedster battle that we can sort of have going on. Well, just so you know, I'm not pushing to attack your flash next turn. Ah, how, see, I was I trying clearly, to get you into that yeah, so hard. I, that I was clearly am rolling fours and... Uh, He's 17 now, Simeon. Yeah. Baby. I will still miss. I have a 10 uh, attack. I need... Night, night Master, excuse me. Too many knights. There's Night Nurse, Night Crawler, Night Master. He's freaking Night Knight. Uh, night Master is going to go for Puma. For Puma has a uh, shape change. Ooh, that'll hit an 18. So we finally do uh, defense. Of, uh, and now well, you bet your sweet buns are rolling for blades. Oh, man. Yeah, I had two damage. I had two. Okay. They're printed two, so that's that's where it is. Well, I'm that is where shape it is. change with Puma. So that's good. Slightly, got a slightly better. Uh, close combat expert now. Uh, Guy Gardner is going to punch this Spider-Man. Just uh, just swinging for the fences. That will hit a twenty with that nine attack. Oh, will it? Jesus. Blades uh, with Guy Gardner says two damage. Okay, so I'll go click six, my last click on this Spider-Man. And, and I even had a printed two damage, so there was no no better option really to roll there. Um, Sweet. Ice. Ice. I believe I, think. I am stuck with two damage people oh, now. So this is great that you have two reducers left, and I mostly I have two it. damage people. It's, uh, it's I think um, it is fun. We're going to have ice... Um, we could incapacitate Nightcrawler, or I think we're gonna range combat expert all in attack. Uh, oh yes, that is correct. I forgot. Never mind. Um, see, thank you, Simeon. Yeah, I see the I see the wall. <laughs> I see the wall. Uh, uh, it's your only defense I have. Clearly, my rollouts aren't working. That's fine. Uh, yeah. Okay. Cool. We'll clear ice. We'll clear Alan Scott Green Lantern, the worst Green Lantern. Answer go. Sweet. I mean, he is just so awful. Puma. Uh, what's he got? Charge with two damage. Sweet, sweet. 
Uh, let's uh, push to put it all into damage and hit Pushing. the Stairmaster, uh, <laughs> king of the gym. Uh, a Stairmaster. Uh, he just, dude, he is, nine he's a Stairmaster. He's Sweat God. Yeah. All right, let's do it up. He's he's just for four, he, he lurches over on that stairmaster thing, and he just these sweats dripping off of him. Yeah, yeah, that's why he's wearing yeah. that weird hat. Does it exactly a sixteen hit? It does, it does, and I think I just have toughness, so I think I just take it. You're taking four. Boy. Taking four. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you'll three. take one. Okay, click four. And I'll I'll go to click five to so reduce it by one. Why not? Uh, it's a decent trade off. Uh. Two for two for three, sure. So now I'm on click. Uh, da, 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 da. click four or five. Should we click four? Okay. okay. Take a push in that. You're on click two. Yeah, we click four. We'll go ahead and outwit Guy Gardner's defense. Ooh, Ooh. We're rolling on to outwit late dial. So I'm just a uh, just a fifteen, a gross, gross fifteen. Try and punch you with the Spidey Man. I don't think he's got anything. Special. What do you What do you need? Like a what is he? He's got to be on his last click. He's a he only nine has for two. Nine for two. So you need a, a solid six. That's within your wheelhouse. Ooh, there it is. Yeah. And we can't do anything about it. Guy is a goner. You deal two damage, I trust. I do. Okay, that's the magic number to get. Sadly, sadly, guy is out of the game. Mm. Uh, we will clear the night crawler. Real and... MVP, that guy. Yeah, that was a... that was an okay turn for me. Mm. Which is sad because I've got three characters left compared to your uh, six. Let's. Oh wait, I've got Night Nurse still. She could totally heal. Just a Night Nurse. I'm gonna t I'm gonna use telekinesis. This is the most useful Alan Scott will be. I'm gonna TK her to here. I think that's where I want to go. Right? Is that? Yeah, that's direct. That's where. That's where I want to go. Okay. Um, that's the most useful Alan Scott is. I'm sorry, guys. That's the one thing I know he will do is be able to use telekinesis at the very least. Uh, ranged combat expert on Nightcrawler. Try to target Nightcrawler. I'm I'll take that. Through hindering. Mm. All right, we're gonna go. We're gonna go all into attack. So this is for this is for one damage here. So it's a twelve to a twenty. Mean eight. Ah, uh, darn it, ice. Darn it, ice. It's because it wasn't incapacitate is why. That's why. Mm, I think we're going to clear the rest of the gang. Not wanting to take any more free damage. We absolutely have to. And it is your turn. I really I really wanted Ice to get that. Man, she's my girl. Okay. Shut to avenge her boyfriend here. Maybe she should have gone for the Spider-Man. Even then, I guess she would have missed. Uh, Puma's going to outwit Alan Scott's defense. Whatever that may be. Impervious. Um, it is impervious. That is correct. Finally, going for that late game, hitting, messing up Alan. Squares with uh, the other Alan on the team, I guess. Night crawly man. I need a number that is high. A seventeen. You got it. it Doesn't eight with hit. with with no defense. You have a ten, right? Yeah. So eighteen. I'll go to click. I'll go to click three. You dealt me that damn it. Two squares. Ooh, you're gonna knock me back. Yeah, all two. two squares. Okay. So those eight squares of movement. I can still move six more. Uh, let's see what six can get me. I can get to the rotunda. Ooh. I can get to a row of seats. I could hide up in the Dial H logo. You cannot hide in the Dial H logo. <laughs> Back to my starting area. Uh. Uh, let's, let's just go and body block night nurse by mm. uh we've uh, really underutilized like, yeah yeah you're gonna base me now okay not only will i uh oh she's also here uh that won't that's matter that's true that uh, is true yeah, so i cannot not only will i knock you back but i'll also follow it up with uh absolutely just basing you anyhow absolutely just basing and just doing nothing yes uh all right cool uh i cannot move forward there's a character in my way i imagine um, no one thought of this rules interaction when this map was made, and it's a very simple one that could have happened back then, and we don't know the answer to now. They banned it immediately because oh, some did people they? talked about special terrain making it bad, and so they just immediately banned it before yes. the set was even out. It's it's the special terrain. It's not the everything else. Battlefield yeah. conditions. 
be a yeah like feats um yeah cool so here's the rough part about this right is now my speedster cannot get to you which i don't know if that's what you're going for but i don't like it oh i totally can get to you if i still have a 14 actually and even then i can go here if you don't have plasticity here but you will be running the backwards way on the track. i will be running the backwards way and the only reason he's able to do that is because he can run faster than the speed of light that's the only way. Otherwise, it's humanly po in impossible to run the backwards way on one of these uh, sky trams. We're going to perplex down your defense with uh, with Alan Scott. Uh -oh. We're going to get Barry's going to zoom up there. I'm going to try to punch you. Okay. Shape change. Oh, my gosh. Um, I mean, I'm going to zoom up to, to there. Ah. Uh, no. Uh, let's try to, uh, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, break away. We got it. We can move one space back. Dang, Barry. Useless Lancer in this, this Barry guy. Let's have Nightmaster. Uh, actually, I think Ragdoll is the better swing on it. We're going to have Ragdoll try to hit you. Do you shape change anymore? Uh, on Puma? Yes, Puma. He's on click four, so that's right. he is now You're high uh, 19. 19. I need so to roll a 10. Reflexes, yeah. We need a 10 with this chick. No, does not get it. What does Nightmaster need? Probably also a 10. He's on click five. I need an 11. Uh, let's go for it. Going for the 11 with Nightmaster. Oh, oh, man, close. Wow. Um, and then we're going to... We're going to let's have Alan Scott try to punch you since we're next to each other right now. And I use my perplex, so we might as well try to punch Nightcrawler. Shape change. Ooh, okay. And we're gonna clear ice. Icy YC is cleared, and it is your go. Wow, wow. Sticking in it. I just wow. Gotta hit a hundred. This more this is left. just going to be, like this is why the games have a timer. Uh, I just realized, cause like, yeah, this is this a is, very long time yeah, to just kill. Hundred points, yeah. For all that stuff. So yeah, um, go for. It. So, stairmasters on click five. I'm gonna outwit uh, Ragdoll. Does she still have super senses and shape change, or does she only have one? She she has them both still, baby. Okay, I'm gonna outwit her super senses. Okay. With Puma, and right. he's gonna try and attack her first. With flurry blades, go for, it. go for it. So, first attack. I think I've got a, I've got a nine. So, sixteen. That will hit. All right, blades in it for two, which is my two goes, goes to click four. And then second attack. You still have shape change. I do still have shape change. Okay. Go for it. Hiya. Mm. Do you have a ten attack right now? I've got a 9, so that's a 16. That will miss, because on click 4, I have a 15 with combat reflexes. Ah. Uh, that's Puma's big thing that he can do. Uh, my dear man will leap and climb to here. I think he's still got that. He does his whole dial, so he'll leap climb to there. Mm -hmm. Uh Oh, forgot to tram people. Uh, ah! Try and break Night Nurse away from Alan Scott. She'll go here. Okay. And okay. I'll clear Nightcrawler. And I'll clear. Oh, that's right. I've got three, three characters. Three people. So then I, I, I will tram people like so. We're going to perplex down Nightcrawler's defense again. We're going to hypersonic with Barry to here. Uh -oh. Try to target Nightcrawler. Shape change. Uh oh. Misses Nightcrawler. Okay. That by a lot. <laughs> like a, I don't want to rub it in, but that's a lot. That you We're going to go here. Thank you very much. Um, go to click three. Do you not need to break away, Calder? Whatever, man. Uh, uh, yes. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I'll stay. I'll stay. Fine. Fine. Uh, Let's uh, have Icy Wicy. You know who doesn't need to break away? Oh, jeez. Nightcrawler. Yeah. Because he's better. <laughs> uh, he's better than Barry Allen. 
ICYC going for the ranged combat expert against Puma here. What does he have defensively right now besides uh, his hindering bonus? So Puma is rocking a 17 defense with combat reflexes. That is all. Let's go ahead. What click is he on? Four. We're going to pump it. Uh, let's do one into each. Uh, you're 17, you're an 18. We're going to need a six. We do all into attack. We're going to go all into attack uh -oh. with ice. 12 for one here. There it is. That's why. That's why we do these things. A hindering bonus. Right. Do you that whole one damage. Go to click five. Um, Ragdoll, you're on click four. Um, I don't think I'm going to push you, nor will I push the Nightmaster. So we're going to clear Ragdoll, Nightmaster, and Alan Scott. Okay. I'd rather not push Puma. But he does have Flurry Blades with an Outwit. Uh, and he does have two characters surrounding him. So she's got a 15... Combat reflexes and shape change. Reflexes. Nightmaster is like something, and he has super Eight. senses. He has super senses. Mm -hmm. I think He's I'd a 15 rather, senses. I think I'd rather get rid of the combat reflexes, so I'm going to outwit that with Puma. I'm okay. going to push him to click six. I'm going to flurry on Ragdoll first. Mm -hmm. So 9 into a 15. Need a 6 for blades. That'll do it. You got it. For a whole 1. Whole 1. Takes me to click 5. So still still alive. Same Sorry. stats? Or... Um, slightly different, I want to say. She is still a 15 combo reflexes. I, everything for defense is all the same. Shape change, 1 damage, 15 combo reflexes. Right. Her attack goes down by 1. She does leave the uh, won't let go special attack power. So you can now freely move, um, which hasn't come up at all this game. Ah. Alright, I'll, I'll finish my attack on, my second attack on her again. Okay. So that'll be a 15. Um... No, I'm 17 combat reflexes. Uh, 15 combat reflexes, so yeah, 17. Well, your combat reflex is still gone. Oh, then I needed to roll shape change, didn't I? Oh, you, did you have it for the first attack? I did. Ah, yes. Okay. Okay, second attack, you can attack uh, Stairmaster, okay. <laughs> Nightmaster instead. Does a 15 hit him? It does. A 15 does hit him. He gets senses, though. He does not get it. Okay, I'll roll blades on him. Needed two, you got it, and we trade. You get you take a Mystics, and I just take a die. So I take a push and a Mystics. I didn't really want mm. to do that, but I will mm. also die from that. You'll die. Uh, Very cool. I am in the dead now. Man, I could have totally healed her. I realized she should have been next to him the whole time. She could have healed one because of Suicide Squad, whatever. Yeah, I kind of wish I had kept my uh, little outwit there. Mm. What is Alan yeah. Scott rocking on click three? You know, you know he's got that toughness. He's got that 16 toughness click three. It's actually pretty solid. So I'm going to hypersonic. Mm. I need a breakaway, so I'm just going to... No, you do don't. Zero, sure. Try Freaking. and punch Alan Scott with Nightcrawler. All right. You got it. He'll take two. So one. So he'll, take, he'll go to click four. And then I'm going to go... Let's see. Go here. Mm. Mm. And just dump him. Ah! Taking me with. And I, mm. I don't get a move again, so that was after the attack. So yeah. Mm. Zero. Actually, I, I mean, since I'm doing that, I could just take you like the full like 14 squares away. But you could. that's fine with me. I'll you could take you. us to finally outside the map, <laughs> where true. we've just... Completely being ignoring the tarmac, the whatever area the, outside the airport. Yeah. Yeah. If if this was like a uh, man bat situation where I could drop you from like elevated, I definitely. Would. Oh sure. Yeah. Uh, Spider Man will clear. Night Nurse will also have to clear. And. Okay. Yeah, that's all I can do that turn. Ragdoll. Uh, first of all, <laughs> Barry goes there. Funny. Ragdoll is going to move how far? Nine speed. She's nine speed her whole time. Okay. 
All right. Move to there. With our nine speed. With a full reg doll. Perplexing down. Do I still have perplex? Actually, let's check. Let's check Green Lantern. We do. We still have perplex. We still have our nine attack. We're going to perplex down Nightcrawler's defense, and we're going to try to punch him. No. Hmm. I'd prefer. We certainly I'd won't. I'd prefer if you did. Um, uh, you know. Man, Razzmatazz. That sucks. We will clear everybody else. These late game uh, rollouts are. I mean, it would have been sweet had I gotten some more early on when I had five more characters than I do now, but yeah. uh, it's late game rollouts. Uh, so, good old Ragdoll is a 17 because of combat reflexes. Yes. Also, shape yeah. change? Uh, yes. Um, does she still have combat Yeah, she still has shape change combat reflexes. What does the Flash have? Mm, the Flash also has combat reflexes right now with a much harder to hit 17 defense. So he's a 19 total? He's a, he's a 19 total, baby. Okay, so I'd need a 10 with Spidey. Uh, Spidro Man is going to swing at... He'll start with Ragdoll. Okay. Nine for two. Okay. Okay. Get a good old crit hit here. Hey! He did. <laughs> wow! Turning the tide, by the way. Just by the by. Just deleting a I call. Uh, crit hit, no big deal. I believe that heals Spider-Man because I called a crit hit. So uh, It does not, as much as you may want it now to. I really wish I had swung at it the is. Flash, though. Man. Dude, yeah, that would have been hot. Uh, much. Uh, Nightcrawler, not going to push, just going to clear. And Night, oh, I guess Outward. Night Nurse technically Outward. moves here. Mm. All right. Let's perplex down Nightcrawler's defense again. Oh, and technically, Spider-Man and... would have moved there. Yeah. All right, fine, fine, I mean, whatever. I, I can fine. stay there if you want. No, do whatever you want. I do whatever you want. About the treadmills. Um, let's go ahead. Punch. Just, we're gonna get rid of the night nurse. We're gonna punch night nurse. Yeah. So she's not there anymore. Fifteen hit. Uh, what's your attack? Ten. Uh, I just I just set it a fifteen. A 15. Hit. <laughs> uh, she's, I gotta, yeah, I, I, yes, I have a ten she's attack. A fifteen top dial. So I'm not gonna tell you what she was. All right. Let's um. Spider -Man up to, like, do I have phasing with Barry? Not Barry. I care about Green Lantern. Barry no. Allen, Scott Allen. No, I don't have Scott phasing. Allen. Um, but perplexing down Nightcrawler's defense again. I'm gonna try to punch him. I will eventually run out of these rollouts, but not today. Ah, oh, jeez, man, look at that. Wild. So I can keep Wild. Hitting, I'll probably be able to win. But I. Uh, I I, I will agree. Does he have, like, a reducer of by, like, two or more at any point? He only has toughness now for the rest of his dial. Okay, so I do only have a chance. Just only has toughness, yeah. Yes. Um, we're going to have Ice try to in-cap Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Oh, that would hit an 18. Are you... I'm pretty sure that he's less than an 18. He is... Even, even through hindering? Yeah, he's a 16, so 17. Oh, nice. 50-50. Eight. See, uh, once I said it was going to be in cap, she started rolling high again. I think I think that's what Ice has to do. All right, here you go. It is your turn. All right, uh, man. Buried alien has. Who's got that nineteen? Move your defense? square, boy. Move yeah. your square. Yeah, we'll go spider the, boy. Uh, I'm just gonna try and punch Alan Scott because that's all, right, all I man. can really. It's really just start perplexing on my own defense. Yeah. Push. I'm a 10 into your something. I should perplex down your damage. Yeah, that would be awful if you did that. Does a 15 that hit? That, that will miss. Okay. I am a glorious, glorious 16 <laughs> defense. I'm going to go right here. Mm. With the good old Nightcrawler. Okay. Oh. You're just, are you leaving? Or are you taking me with here. you? I didn't hit you, so I can't. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah. You're just It'd be sweet run. if I could. Like, uh, See you first, later, bro. Just run through walls with you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll just try and tie you up. I feel like I can... I, I was going to just start pushing like crazy, and I'm no longer going to do that. I'm going to perplex up Alan Scott's own defense. We're going to clear everybody. Okay. Now, my chance to push like crazy... Uh, let me click on Nightmaster. Uh, Nightcrawler. 
He's not bad if I push him to click two. He only loses one click of defense, and I've been successfully shape-changing out of stuff. Problem is, on click three, he loses all mobility. So it's like almost... Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot. If he uses super senses and invades, he can move up to half his speed. I don't know if that's happened. I think it's mostly been shape change. Uh, it's mostly been shape change. I don't think I've ever hit you once to even let you use super senses. Oh, I'm going to move here and here. And then I will just clear Nightcrawler. Mm. And I'll just leave Spider-Man untokened so I can potentially yank somebody to him. Okay. All right, cool. Let's... Alan Scott, it's, we got to fly up, baby. We, I don't want to go on the defensive. I want to just kill Nightcrawler. That is for sure. Um, I want to kill Spider-Man too. Nightcrawler being next to me. Barry Allen. Crazy high defense, though. Crazy high defense. Um, Alan Scott can do nine squares. Let's go ahead. Or it's, let's go ahead and rocket him. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine. We have to move him nine to there because the flash has to move to there. So really, let's move him nine. Move him to there instead. Okay. Oh, we're not ice ranged combat expert shooting this Spider-Man. All into attack. Uh oh. Of course. Good job, Ice. It'll probably hit. Uh, 50 50. Ah, uh, Spider Man's dead. Sometimes that 50 just ain't the right 50. Yeah. Um, I got enough rollouts out of this game. Yeah. I think, so. Perplexing down Nightcrawler's defense. Uh, going, going with it for the flash. Just uh, punching you. Shape change. Uh oh. Mmm. I know 17 doesn't hit. No, I've got an 18 with a perplex. So, so very close. Uh, that is your turn, my man. All your right. turn. Nightcrawler, gonna try and... Let's take out Ice. Mm. You finally wisened up to her I mean, being my MVP, really. I attempted wow. to earlier. You did. did not work That's out true. for me. That's 17 uh, defense, though. We'll go here. Need that 7. Need that average roll. A. You got it for two. Thank you. She'll go to click three. Okay. So that was that was seven squares, I believe. Ice finally taking some damage. Uh, she doesn't have any improved movement, right? She used to have leap climb. She does not anymore. So I can go another seven. We'll go. Hmm. To here. Mm. Just dump her right there. You're gonna drop me in that hindering, okay. Yeah. Okay. I would love it if I could somehow in-cap you with ice right now. I need a 10 to hit. <laughs> you got shape change and like whatever else. Super senses and we're gonna 19. fly. We're gonna fly carrying this guy eight squares. I mean eventually I'll miss my shape change and then you'll just crit hit me. And now that I've said it, I would even, love it's even I would doubly love that. more likely to happen. Oh, not him. Not him. This guy gets the token. Running move there, we're perplex down your defense. Ice is going to incapacitate you. All right. Because that's what she really does best. Shape change. Ah, <sighs> oh, man. Ice is taking a push. Going to click four. Giving herself a token. And it is your turn. Man, clear the flash, however. I am going to clear the mm. flash, also known as the night crawler. Okay. Where to move four like Are you that? Walking around hindering like some um, sort of, <laughs> some sort of <laughs> plebeians, like a the surf in the kingdom okay. that's known as Nightcrawler. Oh, all right, just species. cut it out. <laughs> I can't wait to paint yourself blue. Perplexing down damage. your defense. Uh, you know what? Just because we're gonna perplex down your damage value. Okay. Um, now we're gonna try to hit you with the flash. Let's see what. Let's yeah, shape change it, and okay. then watch me watch me roll an eight. Oh, right, whatever, it's seven. Uh, it's gonna miss anyways. Uh, breakaway, got it. 
think we're just gonna go back to here. You failed honestly. two breakaways with that flash this game. It's and then clear. Pretty fun. Uh, so you perplex my damage down. Perplex your damage down, yeah. All right. What is uh, Ice's defense? Good old Ice. Right now, click four. She's a 16. 16. Okay. And no... Nothing. 16. Uh, and Flash still Dude. has... He's still that 19. He's still a combat reflex. Is that 19, baby. All right. We'll go ahead and try and... Do like, we'll just punch Ice. I just this is gonna be really simple. Like Nightcrawler is probably gonna win this this game for you. That gets I her. I hope so, because uh, there's nothing else on my team right now. I mean, I I, I do truly believe uh, oh. that Nightcrawler is gonna get it. I'll go here. Jeez, man. And just dump her in this chair. <sighs> okay. And. Uh, Jeez. You know, what? I'll, Jeez. Go, I'll go ahead and give her two actions too. Just <laughs> okay, kill it. <laughs> sure, sure. Yeah, no, that seems uh, fair. No. Uh, yeah, that's my 14th speed, so I'll just go all the way over there. Really do you make not make your flash I, I think about where speed. Uh, you do not. Oh, no, you place it. You're not carrying her. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Man. You're nine away. I'd have to flex up my range with the Green Lantern. Uh -oh. uh, Barry Allen, do I want to push? Not really. Perplex range, Green Lantern. Go for it. Need a need an eleven to <laughs> hindering terrain. Uh, what Man, click do you want? You crit hit. You crit hit. You crit hit. You crit hit. That's yeah. what we're going for. Perplexing up range. Going for it. Nightcrawler shape change. Shape change. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. All right. Um, if I could just harness all these sixes. Ah, dude. Use them in my attacks. Ice. Ice will now try to incapacitate you. Okay. She still has that. Ah, there's a failed. No shape change on that one. This is our crit miss is on ink. Ah, man. There's a high eight. And I know that she's, there's no way she has an 11. Um, yeah, she's a nine. She's a nine. Goodness gracious. Uh, and we'll clear the flash. What tough luck. Oh, no. I'm on click five. I Excuse me. I do not have incapacitate. That would have just had to been a normal attack roll. Oh, thank goodness. Yes. Thank goodness. For how much damage? Would it would have been done? whole two, baby. Okay. So it would have done... One more um, damage than incapacitate. Yes. Uh, I'm going to clear either way. You're going to clear. I am going to move. I realize this 19 is very important to me, and so I will never push. Green Lantern to here. It. We will perplex down your 19. Flash will then hypersonic. Uh-oh. He's going to get mad because all the Ten trash squares. talk I've been talking about him being Ten a whole squares, bad speedster. So, shape change. Number six. Dude, this is crippling. This is so. <laughs> this is so rough. The fact that super er, that Spider Man couldn't get a fifty fifty, but uh, Nightcrawler. Dude, you're crushing it. We have like to clear. It. We have to clear ice, and it is your go. Man. Uh, I'm gonna continue the attack on ice. Wait. Uh. uh so not cool, by what the way. Is, what is? He's Scott's 17 defense. combat reflexes. He's a 16 toughness, Alan Scott. On all click four. 16 toughness. Yeah, I just gotta take out ice. So we'll hypersonic punch her. Mm hmm Hopefully. Ooh, 14. I think a 14 misses. It misses, baby. Uh, ice is safe. She's in the game. We'll go. And now and now you get to do this thing. <laughs> this guy. Uh right there. And that's uh <laughs> That's all I got. Man, I hate it. <laughs> we're going to perplex up Ice's defense, and we're going to clear Alan Scott. We're going to clear Barry Allen. And I'm going to think I'm going to pap Ice move. She's leap climb. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven to there. Don't, don't even. Don't even this guy. Don't try. Don't try this. This is so long. The, the longest part of this game is going to be just these people trying to kill Spider-Man. Yeah. It is your go now. I wish there was a way I could speed it up, but I, I don't think there is. Uh, I will clear... Okay. Like I could just speed up the whole video and make says, it sound uh, like chipmunks. Uh, yeah, let's not do that. Flash, Barry Allen, still a 13 here. <laughs> Can he make it? No, but because at the beginning of your turn, you have to move one square. Ah. So I can. I can just barely make it. Once you move your character one square. 
like you have to do because of the map. See, my range is uh, I could just <laughs> go. I could just Ju beat up the Beast Boy guys. <laughs> <laughs> what a scumbag all right <laughs> all right the flash zips proposing up his attack value with alan scott shape change uh oh here it comes i've been asking for it okay you can attack it hit. hits an 18 once again no very wise of you to not to not get rid of your stuff it we're gonna just fly yeah we're gonna fly alan to here Kind of like a general area, middle-ish of the map. And it is it is your turn. It is your turn. I'm going to count these squares, because... Uh, seven, okay. Just try and kill ice. Mm. Hey. That will kill ice. I hate to say it. She she was the best. I do miss her. Back. No, she dies. Uh, Leave ice alone. So that was, that was seven squares... Um, I really kind of just want to like move, like, right here, <laughs> just to like mess with your Barry Allen. Uh, we'll do that. We'll end right there. So you're behind the desk. Yeah. Hello, I'm the nightcrawler. I'm the behind <laughs> the desk. What flight are you on? Oh, don't cough. That's the wrong flight. You're the totally wrong wing of the airport. What are you doing? I'm I was count to to five. We got eins, zwei, drei. Why are you gone? Why are you here? Leave. You can't. I started to turn to Arnold Schwarzenegger. There. Sorry. Um, <laughs> He's Austrian. It's close enough. Yeah, close enough. Offending all the zero people that watch YouTube yeah. our YouTube channel in Germany. Huge hero clip. Um, Germany. Uh... I hate you. Uh, perplexing down your defense. And shape change, man. Trying try to shoot you. Sorry. All right. I don't. I don't know what else there is for me to do. Okay. I mean, if you crit hit. Oh. Once again, though, uh, it was the hindering bonus that saved you this time. Ah. And Alan Scott's lack of ignore stealth and not ignore hindering. I mean, we yeah, have to move. We have to move Barry Allen one square, and then it is your go. Ah, man. I'm gonna clear Nightcrawler. I feel like Alan Scott was like what 135 points. It's 145 points. He is so, quite a, a lot. Yeah, I've got him to click four. I imagine it's gonna take me a long time to whittle him down to like click nine or wherever he dies. Yeah, I will. I'll agree. Uh, and he has regenerate over. last click if you're not careful. Jeez. So let's do Barry Allen. He we're gonna perplex up his attack value and. All right, move nine squares. Well, really. Goodness great. I don't know why I counted out so bad. Yes. Eight squares. What am I doing? <laughs> okay. We're going to move eight squares to there. Try to punch Nightcrawler. Hey. <laughs> okay. Breakaway. Wow. Thanks. Um, pop on over to here. Clearing. Um, geez. And it's your go. Right. Wow. Wow. This, uh, we might be playing for another 40 minutes. We're gonna... Just this. <laughs> Hypersonic to here. Okay. Try and punch the Flash with Night Just Alex. going for the Flash, this guy. Oh my gosh! That hits. Yeah. That hits. I knew I had to eventually for two. I go to click five. Ah. And then... Ah. Pop back behind my kiosk. Ah, I hate you. Um... Did I block my own line of fire? It seems that I have. Um, perplexing up <laughs> Green Lantern's defense. And I think I'm going to move him. I'm just going to move him to there. Uh -oh. And I know you ignore characters. So that does nothing for me, really. But I'd have to push, yeah. You would have to push. And so, Flash. Will not, so. You will not. So now I've got a few attacks here. Perplexing down your defense. We're going to have Flash. He, he now has this really sweet ability that I've been waiting to use. Oh, the flurry. Which is the flurry before each attack while using flurry. You may place him adjacent to an opposing character on the map. We are only a 9 for 2. We are but a 9 for 2. So finally uh, gonna be the placed. Flash is faster and better. I am actually, yes, that is true. I am finally faster and better than Nightcrawler.
Let's let's go for it. First flurry attack, perplexing down your defense. You need it. Something I don't remember. You, sorry, is that two shape yeah, change? That was my shape change. Okay. Does that hit? That will hit an eighteen. That will hit because I perplexed it down. That will hit. Oh, an eighteen. Okay, super mm -hmm. senses. Hey. <laughs> and Come I, on! I will go. Um, seven squares to there. So, but here's the cool thing about that. Before yeah, each, yeah, yeah. Flash gets I, get a, to... I get a follow. That's actually this is pretty good now. Uh, shape change again. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. oh yes. No. Two so, damage. So I'll go two to three. Damage. Um. That's not no knockback for... into the X map, but still a two damage. Um. Oh, yeah. you're dead. That's you're dead. Yeah. You're. Dad. <laughs> so Barry Allen. I am just now gonna at move. Nine for two. Just yeah. gonna move. This is what it was. It was just about getting you off. Yeah, that is your, it was just. Is, I eventually had to miss. Yeah, that's yeah. all. Yeah, really. Um, had a lot to go through. We probably spent ten to fifteen minutes just doing this little roundabout attack. This is a great game. This is also a really close game in a different way. Um. I mean, that the Duke off thing, really bad Avengers Justice League game. Yeah, that's it totally swung so poorly for but, you. Uh, that's okay. Uh, Nightcrawler will attempt to crit hit Barry Allen. Yes. Does a, I believe I've got a 9 attack. Does a 16 hit. Does not. He still has the um, combat reflexes. Combat reflexes. Still a 17 combat reflexes. Jeez. Yeah. That Barry Allen is nasty for 119. Um, that's all I got. So you need We're to hit. To, yeah. Uh, I, I will. I will push Barry. Uh, we'll perplex at his attack value. He'll flurry you. Okay. Hmm. That first one will miss. Now it's time for the second one, and that one will hit. I imagine. Ah. Hmm. You got it. So I can go. I can still go have my speed value, which is six. I have to clear, clear the green lantern. I'm gonna pop back to my kiosk. And it is your go. So now I personally would have like a much harder thing for me to do than try to get to your kiosk is, and I realize I can go anywhere on the map with the flash, but like you could have finally taken it outside to the tarmac area, but you just really like that. I thought about it, but. Hello and welcome to the, the airport. Yeah, it's yeah. just, for me, it's all about, uh, it's, uh, you know, safety. And I've got so I think, around me. I think we're just going to clear the flash, perplex up. Um, the Flash's defense, or both blocks of our, our, green, our green Lantern's defense, and it's your go. I don't think it really matters to to move anywhere. Right. Surprise shoot through blocking attack. Right. Alan Scott uh, sure. has a 27 hit for 6 it, damage. Now, 27 would hit, yes, oh, okay. but no. That's I'm, I can't do anything. I, I have a 12 speed with stealth and no willpower, so I'm staying here. You, you coward. I'm letting you come Perfecting to me. Sing up Barry Allen's attack value. Flurrying. Super senses left. Teleport here because of flurry. First attack misses. Second attack does hit, though. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Oh my gosh. I will. And where are you going to move? To right okay. There. Move into there. Didn't see this coming now. And then we'll have yeah. Alan Scott punch you. Oh, I. <laughs> okay. That was silly. Uh, that will hit 18. Uh, 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 oh my god! Bam, right back to what the is... Bam. <laughs> and then It's like it's I incapped you almost. Oh my goodness. It's kind wow. of... It's almost like I planned that, but uh, <laughs> it's just real bad planning on my part that turned out well. Jeez. I'm going to punch your flash now. Gracious. <laughs> yes. What is this? <laughs> For how much? Uh, so it should be three. Cause, yeah, I'm on click three, oh so gosh. two damage one, two, plus one three. for the crit. I go to click eight? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know how you're still alive, but I also don't know how I'm still alive. Wow. So I'm, I'm perfectly Dude, this, fine with this exchange. This term of events is not what I expected. I also just rolled four sixes in a row, back to back. Also that. Six, Did six, you lose it? Two double sixes. Uh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. Moving with the Green Lantern. Um, 
perplexing up the Flash's defense. The Flash now has outwit, and Uh-oh. We, we can outwit your super senses, which is what we're going to do right now. And we're going to clear the Flash. And it's your go. I don't like that. You don't. Um, so you, now you have to move somewhere and push, and then just let me do what I was going to do anyways. I'm just going to push to punch the Flash. Oh, okay. His defense right now. Flex it up, so he's a 17 toughness. Okay. Oh my god. That'll hit for at least one. Oh my gosh. That will kill the Flash. That is... That sucks. That is rough. Alright, Alan Scott. Oh, wow. Let's wow. see what you can do. Dude, see, like, now I totally thought I had you, and now I'm less certain if I have you right yeah, now. I mean, I I do have, like, I doubt that you go down to two damage at some point, but I do yes. have, like, a sneaky blades um, click in there. Speaking, speaking of two damage, I will perplex that in your damage and clear. Okay. I will also do the clearing. What is your defense right now? It's probably a normal super senses. I imagine you've lost your special. Yeah, 17 normal super senses. But I need to get rid of the flash because outwit would have uh, ruined me. I would have crippled you, man. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's not good. Let's. <sighs> the safest call is to continue to perplex down your damage. But that's lame. So we're going to perplex up my attack. Green Lantern. Will you hit and attack this game? It is a 10. Uh, you 17? Yes. Okay. Oh. Okay. Nope. <laughs> and it's your go. Oh, man. I don't know if I want to move into hindering. Try and break away and move into hindering to get my stealth to, like, work. Uh, but I've got an 8 attack. What's Alan Scott's defense right now? It is, it is a 16 tough. 16 Jeez. toughness. So I need an 8 just to hit. I'm going to go ahead and just swing for it while I still have 2 damage. Uh, eight, need an eight to hit. Not even close. Okay. Mm. Finally, my, my rolls are reversing now. Um, perplexing down your damage. Gonna hit you with Alan Scott. That will hit. Uh-oh. There we go. Ooh, for, how much? for three. For three. For three. Do I have a click seven? I do not. Oh my gosh. Wow. Um, and so what I was gonna do is Eventually, I was trying to figure out when I wanted to take a push to put him on his pulse wave click. Uh, and this was finally when I was going to do that. Yeah. Uh, just click five. He has a nine for three like he always does. But instead, he has pulse wave uh, and still has his perplex. I was hoping that wow. I would somehow manage to get to click six and then just blades you for a bunch. Like, I mean, just, wow. Those, uh, those rolls. Goodness gracious. Like, I, I was complaining about my attack rolls early on. Wow. But such a long hit, game. I, I also such hit a long uh, game. two crits. Yeah. We, let's, not, let's not take up anyone's time. Let's not. Let's get so, right uh, into it. This is another two hour game. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> next week, we will be no, jumping I into. I have a script reading for this. Come on, man. Don't, don't, don't at me like this. We'll be jumping into the My Fast Force show. Green Lantern. And the Don't Green Lantern Gravity that. Feed, which That's has false. 10 figures. Uh, so let me do my read. Vote for another epic Golden Age Solid brawl. Back. I mean, quote-unquote, epic Golden Age brawls come to a close. Reminder, you can vote for what figures we use on Facebook, Twitter, Discord, and the comment section of this video. Next week, I'm building from Giant Size X-Men, I believe. I'm Ron Burgundy. And yes, you are building from the man. Captain America set. Oh, I got rocked. Yes. I have to play with another Wolverine-based like set. You have to play against... Uh, and you, I, you get Captain America. So, yeah. I'm going to choose... You can look through a character. Deal. App, if you want to. Oh, I already know. Yeah. Oh, you know, you yeah, know, it's Monkey Weapon X. Joe and Squirrel Girl. Oh, okay. I mean, sure. clearly. Uh, no, talk about the figure that you like from Captain America. You'd want to check out here. I feel like we have to have eventually. Dude, I love all the chases. With his, uh, Rajaz yeah. is the only chase. Rajaz is awful, but uh, Bob, Captain Agent of Hydra, pretty solid. The set is actually really cool. Like. It has, like, a lot of lame figures in it, but it also has, like, a lot of really cool, like, picks they decided to do. Dirk yeah. Anger, the human all this Torch cool stuff. is one of the coolest sculpts in the game, yeah. like, honestly. Uh, the little bubble effect that, like, fits on the base. Um, yeah. But, yeah, there's plenty of plenty of crazy yeah, cool stuff in Captain America. I know people like GSX. I don't. I own very few figures in the set. I do not care about GSX at all. But what I, who I do care about is... Um, I forget what they were called. Onslaught. Next Wave? No. Uh, is it Next Wave, right? 
that's uh, Machine Man, the Captain. Uh, yeah. Uh, Boom Boom. That's who I would like. Yeah. Anyone with Next Wave, I would love. The the Captain and Aaron Stack, Machine Man specifically, would be great. I want to hit that, that awesome uh, two-move, Earthbound Neutralize, six-attack, poison, 14 defense click with the Captain, because it's hilarious and awesome. So... I really, I would love to play just an all next wave theme. This next go around would be great. Let us know what you guys thought of this video. Like, comment, subscribe, share it if you're so inclined to do so. If you want a notification every time a Thursday Throwdown happens, well, hit that darn notification bell. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Happy trails.